They can hear my voice. They can hear you guys. What's up, Chad? How's everybody doing? Yo. Hello, everybody. Where, where's everybody in chat? I want to see the stream avatars like running wild at the bottom. People aren't chatting right now. Uh, maybe they got my afraid slayer. by the. Uh, oh, my slayer went away. Maybe the stream elements banned. Scared them away. <laughs> <laughs> Let me get my slayer back in there. We've got oh, a unique yeah. community that's full of chatters isn't chatting right now. This is the saddest. And they'll come. They they always come. They come a little bit late. But uh, I yeah. saw someone say yesterday that Strive was uh, made by a Slayer player. But anyways, I won't. <laughs> Sorry, I cut off your intro. No, I mean, no, not really. <laughs> I was just gonna say the bracket was at like four people this morning. And now it's a pretty nice size. We got 23 gamers in the chat. Mm. Or not in the chat, in the bracket. Damn. But uh, yeah, I'm excited. We didn't get to run the beginner bracket yesterday for uh, internet reasons. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's unfortunate, but it is how it is. You know. But um, everything is going good today. Apparently, Optimum is going to come on Wednesday and actually fix it, they claim this time. This is just surely. Yeah. I've um, been there. Yeah, yeah. It's only it's going on like two months now. <laughs> yeah. Of them being like, yeah, we'll come fix it. We'll come fix it. But um, I'm excited for actually all the sets we have marked for round one. We've got Twang versus Koyo, and then Ray K versus Malarkey. Hmm. Yeah. So it'll be interesting. I think this is gonna be what Akatsuki Lene. No, Batista. Oh, Batista. Actually, we'll get, right. see, we'll get to see Batista in both of our matches. My only oh, request true. is no hide today. I saw too much hide on Saturday. Please, no more <laughs> hide. Just, no right, hide. Well, let's duck all of Deffy and Thomas matches. They're going to yeah, play Tom. the hide mirror on purpose. Dude, our top three at uh, at the live was hide, hide, I and saw hide. That. Yeah. Even the first comment on the YouTube video was, wow, so much hide. <laughs> hide must be broken, surely. We had, I think our top six was three hides, two Linnaes, and what, like one phone on? <laughs> Damn. Damn. Oh yeah, also track Suchi, thank you for the $50 into the match, Reno. Yeah, like I, we haven't been shouting you out like all the time, but you, you've you been, you've been holding down these yeah. brackets. Track so the much. GOAT. <laughs> the GOAT! <laughs> okay. So Akatsuki, Koyo, or Akatsuki uh, Batista dash blocking is the name of the game here. But Koyo's off to a good start first hit already. And yeah, this is this is one of those Akatsuki matchups where you're rushed down, and you have to find your way in with your with your little puny dash block. You try your best, but he gets the five ACS, good confirm. Yeah, I'm gonna see some nice little corner carry here. See the I like the does on pressure. Mm -hmm. Nice little dash block into the fireball. Gets the cycle. Now it's Twang's turn. Oh, shows the shield at the wrong time. Yeah, right now in Akatsuki Jail. Good. Yeah, knows that spacing flash kick will whip. Gets a big punish here too. Yeah, this is uh, this is death. 4.9? Pretty much almost 5k. Meterless? Or not meterless, I mean, uh, counter hit. With no counter hit. Wow. That's actually wild. He, he needs the damage. He really does. Yeah. Alright, Koyo. Wow, what a dash 2b2c. An aggressive wake up option does give him the cycle though. Using a bit of the, the cycle mind games there to get the cycle. Koyo trying to do the same. Ooh, Doesn't work minute. out. Yeah, I guess yeah. the cycle. Lots of Koyo. staggers, but Twang is not biting. Yeah, I think Koyo's a little wary of the chain shift, but Twang okay. is just holding one little mix up. That's a big hit! Could be the match. No draw. Or to drop, but still, like, throw will kill. This is just, this is super scary right now. Trying to call out an OS or something, but Quayle well, just kind of holding down back. Being a little patient. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Being a little too patient, but. Yeah, Twang was just walling out, throwing some predictive uh, hitboxes out. 
trying to just stay in the corner. No need to really dash up into their faces unless they're being too passive, which Twang took advantage of. Oh my god, goes over the fireball there. So he jumped three times, wow. Okay. Ooh, oh my god, they are, they are pressing. That's Twang pressing some buttons in this combo. It drops though. Ooh, tries to go for a little empty low on the, uh, the J6C. Koyo, good uh -oh. defense though. <laughs> Never mind, it's thrown. It's Yomi. The 660 fireball loop. Ooh, oh again. my. Oh, wait. <laughs> I don't even think Twang was ready for that one. They both like stopped. That was interesting. <laughs> but Twang cleans up the alarm. Cleans up the round. Yeah, I think punish. Koyo is trying to zone and Twang is like really doing a good job just dashing in. Oh like, my, I did not. That was, that was kind of good. <laughs> Twang is kind of just running Koyo to the corner and I think Koyo needs to take advantage of that and maybe press the offensive more because Twang's just holding forward and neutral and Koyo is just holding <laughs> one. Infinite, with two just to mash out. Mash out at the right time, but. Twang finding himself in the corner now. Could be Koyo's chance to get something started, but it looks like it's not. Yeah, Koyo's just kind of trapped in the corner, and like they've already seen that flash kick whiffs at the spacing Twang's playing at, so they, they're kind of lost for an answer right now. Mm -hmm. And I'm not sure if they'll find the answer in time, because Twang has such an overwhelming lead right now. Yeah, and I think, CS too. I think Twang has won every cycle. Okay. Oh my! Oh. <laughs> that actually caught the extended hitbox. I'm just kind of surprised that that even has a hitbox <laughs> or a hurt box. But uh, wow, gets whiff punished. Damn. Yeah. Let me see. How far away was that? Hey, yeah. yeah. Kind of decent. Maybe gem. J2C is. I don't know. I don't. Th I don't think that's connecting. Without, yeah, it's definitely Oof. not connecting without the button. Damn. Good stuff to Twang. Also, uh, <laughs> good stuff to Twang, but Track Suchi. God damn. <laughs> uh, good stuff to the match, what? Reno, bro. Track Suchi tossing in another boy. 69. Pretty sure he calculated, or they calculated, how many, how much the codes will give us to take us to top four payout. <laughs> and then just no kind of like left us right on the edge. So uh, yeah, if you well, guys haven't already, seven. please use the code so we can secure top four payout because uh, it would be uh, tragic to not hit it. <laughs> Don't let it sacrifice that massive, made. massive donation. Thank you so, so much. Yeah, that is wild. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> if we finish these codes, I think we're just chilling. <laughs> so. Yeah, like we're chilling in top four. Holy smokes. Thank you so much. That is insane you know we don't uh obviously like <laughs> expect any of this so very uh oh nice you meetings. realize your missed opportunity to donate 69 the first time because it's the 69th mash fest oh my god it is yeah I mean... <laughs> <laughs> but uh yeah i i definitely i thought for a second i had left the wrong matrino link at the bottom of the bracket because i saw i was at like 140 something i was like did i leave one of the lives like what happened and uh, no, we just got a massive donation. So thank you very much. Yeah, very nice of her. Already at 97.8, 98%. Those codes are flying <laughs> in. Thank you, guys. Oh, man. So we're going to see another Batista now. Yeah. This is going to be Batista Nanase. Yes. Yeah, we got Ray K. Malarkster. Yeah, Ray K. Go ahead. Or, from what I remember, Ray K, they played a much more like zoning Batista. Mm -hmm. I don't know if that's still true now, but I think Nanase has some decent tools to deal with all the zoning. So I'm kind of curious to see how this plays. Mm -hmm. Yeah, uh, Koyo and Ray K are are are, are our mm -hmm. two WASD Batista players. Yeah. Yeah, there's some guy called Roxy Halo, but he doesn't play anymore. Yeah. Nobody knows him. The only person who ducks nearly as much as me is Roxy. <laughs> <laughs> Don't get me started. It's been like 
a year and a half since I asked him to play plus R with me. I think I forgot Roxy. Type in the chat. He'll do like the little the face with the carrots. <laughs> We're going into the people that aren't ducking the match. Oh my god, round start J8C, I believe, is that move we're gonna say. Yeah, we're seeing some dash blocks. Yeah, Ray K. Okay, it's Malarkster's turn. It's interesting to. I want to try and see the differences between Ray K and the Koyo's performance. Okay, V okay, flash yeah. kick. Zoning time. Oh, gets a plus frames. I like that. Ending the pressure in the safe rebeat, but uh, oh, that is. I'm gonna assume that's not what they wanted, but if so, that was a big gamble, and they are paying hard for that. Yeah, 4.5. They also have chain shift, so it's a bit scary there. Oh, just Vio's out of the instant overhead setup. Using the 204C to extend pressure. About even life leads here, but obviously Batista has the advantage in the neutral. But Marcer has a chain shift and uses yeah. it ADP. No meter to follow up though. Okay. Like he's turned on pressure, very scary. The 2B2C. Good challenge on seeing the gem set. Yeah, not to say 2B super good mash out option. Oh, round star laser. Malarkey kind of caught off guard. Oh, there's the overhead. Does not VO at this time. Reiki gonna get a nice knockdown here. Scary situation. <laughs> oh, Malarkey. Yeah, just, just getting some there. space. Yeah. Resets to neutral uh, and gets out of there, but does lose the cycle because of those back dashes. Nice change shift from the FF to extend the combo here. Gonna watch out on the cycle though, if Rikki doesn't stop. Yep, Malarkey's gonna get the cycle. Ooh. Yep, the delay gets, but not too much reward off it. I think is fine eating that, just zoning again, especially with such a huge life. Bleed! <laughs> what? Wow. Yeah, that, that, yeah. yeah. She, she got a parry because she needed it. I'm surprised it was that active, but. Yeah. Also, like, Nanase Sword Car moves her forward so fast that, like, it, uh, and sometimes just goes through moves. Yeah, Ray K just kind of smoothing right now. Oh! Oh no, drop the combo. Okay, there's the overhead, don't worry. This should be death. Yes, it is. Perfect to close it out. Ray K just kind of, like, <laughs> became unleashed in that last round. Mm -hmm. Um, honestly, like I know I mentioned before, I was expecting a bit more zoning, but it's really the offense here that's been the scariest part. And like Malarkey's being kind of caught off guard, bullies 50-50s, high low. Yeah, Reiki is, I think, doing a good job between switching between zoning and. Uh and uh pressure but even when he zones it's only like a, or even when they zone it's only like a hit or two before deciding to just uh send it in because once you start respecting batista's zoning you can use that chance to just dash up on your opponent and get in yeah oh cycle dash up throw Malarkey still gets the cycle due Ooh. to that fireball a little too slow to confirm the air hit there but oh the low opens up Oh, the low again. Actually, wait, the move's not a low. That's just a move. Ooh. Oh. Yeah, that is not plus. You you better challenge that. And good side switch, put him back in the corner. Oh, oh no, no confirm. If he was expecting a counter hit there, can't blame you for expecting a counter hit. Why wouldn't they get counter hit? I... Oh, we're seeing a combo here. What an option oh, to go over the oh. laser. <laughs> I, I guess that works. Yeah, I like the throw before the fireball hits. Keep it a little tricky. Keep them on their toes. Oh, big 2B2C challenge again. Okay, just, yeah, play around with the space Ooh. fireball creates. Unfortunately, puts himself in the corner in that long animation. That's an easy punch for AK. Ooh. Yeah, big drop. And does find a way out with the chain shift, though. See what you do. Oh, the overhead! Do a little mixing. Oh, nice tech, recognizing the situation from before. Quick concentrate to see that cycle. Very nice from Reiki. Lots of health uh, deficit, though. 
Oh, doesn't get to finish. Yeah, Malarkey is playing patient. Almost has a hundred meter. Can go through fireballs with that EX Sword car if they want to. Yeah. Has chain shift, but a little boneless there doesn't net him too much. Malarkey really scared of a reversal option here. Oh, nice okay. throw. Yeah, I think the, the patience really adding up there. It's like for Malarkey. A lot of the really short block strings, looking to see how Reike is going to respond and then responding accordingly, I guess works out, but we'll see what Reike does in response. Just a little, little stray hits, nothing too big right now. Oh, barely manages to get the cycle there. Yeah, oh wow, assault right over the, the 2FF. 2FF, yeah, 2FF, 2FF is a pretty good option for Batista, but it has no follow-ups, so she cannot do anything after it's uh, blocked, and it's minus 2, I believe. So unless she has chain shift, she can't uh, continue pressure afterwards. Yeah, this should be bad. Okay, round start. Yeah, I kind of like that jump back by Malarkey. Reike has been pretty offensive on round starts, so playing it a bit more defensively isn't a bad idea, in my opinion. Oh, kind of going somewhere, trying to call out the, the air little stand thing that Tista does. Okay, CS. Yep, yeah, gonna get a combo here. Nice, little damage. Mix-up time. Oh, big view out of the corner. No mix-up time. Rick does not care, though. Nice block, block on the overhead. overhead. Yeah. <laughs> Larky is... <laughs> yeah, actually, after Nanase, you block a sword car, you can stand up, and uh, she doesn't have a low, a low follow-up off the sword car. So, standing up is the right option. Rick knew, knew that. Rick on defense gets clipped by the low. Malark's are... Uh, could still win this round. Nanase does not do too much damage, though. So he's gonna have to open them up. Nice assault, but Reike does get the cycle, so still has a chance here. And the drop. Yeah, yeah throw punish. This is... That could that could be the tied turn of the match, and it is. I think that might have been a 2-3-6-C there. Um, I think that was 5-C. Mm. I'm gonna guess that was... Yeah, I think that was maybe like 2-6-C. Maybe they missed the 3 in butter. I think that's what happened. Unfortunate. Yeah, we'll be able to to see here on the instant replay uh, what Malarkser may have pressed. Dash blocking, dash blocking. Oh yeah. Yeah. Definitely did not Dude, mean the five C. Damn. The orb. That's how life do be. <laughs> yeah, but good stuff. Uh, to Reiki. Moving on through our bracket round and for our two. next match, we are moving on to round two, and we will be seeing Azure Under Knight, Seth Player versus Gravy Jones, who will be playing Lond, I believe. Yep, yeah, most likely. Thank you. I I wouldn't be surprised at either or. Oh, I think we're gonna see the Lond. Yeah, against Seth, uh, Lond is a better matchup, so I I would not be surprised. Yeah, it's definitely like it's. Also good for Enkidu though, because FF, he has FF and then he also has his JA hits on both sides. Mm -hmm. So that's very strong for Blink. Oh, yeah. Um, so both picks are actually fine here. I'm not sure which one Kirby's is feeling. It's kind of just going to be player preference. I, well, we'll I feel like every time I've seen him play recently, he's been playing uh, Lond. Like, I mm -hmm. rarely see him go to the Enkidu unless it's like super late night gaming. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but uh I'm stoked. I'm stoked he he had off work so we can actually join. And he yeah. got his internet upgraded the whole nine yards. Let's go. You know what I'm stoked for? The top four payout that will hopefully be happening if you guys type exclamation mark match arena. Let's go. We're so close. We got seventeen We're... codes left and we are two seventy five away from top four payout. And if you can do math, that's enough money. So, <laughs> you should do the codes. It is if more you can't do money. math, that's also enough money. 
Yeah, it doesn't matter if you can actually <laughs> do the math yourself or not, but clicking the button will give us 25 cents. It's a prize pool. Yep. Uh, let me find... Okay, so we got gravy in the room. We just gotta get Azure Undernight. I see the codes coming in. Thank you, guys. Let's go. Did we make the Did we make the threshold already? This would be the earliest, I think, we've no, not ever made. Yet. The... 99%. Also, <laughs> real quick, if you want... Uh, or Empiris Club is running some some drip. You already knew what I was going to say. I knew exactly where you were going. <laughs> um, <laughs> There is a hoodie in the and a hoodie and a t-shirt of the Stantec gang hoodie and t-shirt designs. They're super cool. But the pre-orders end on the 31st. They end in two days. And they will not be coming back once they're gone. Yeah, they'll so. be gone forever. I know the photos up there are my crappy uh, cell phone photos because I couldn't find anyone to help me take good pictures. But they do look sick. I've been wearing them every day, but I finally had to just toss them in the wash. <laughs> but I am wearing the Honest Mids hoodies. Which are Let's also go. up on the site. But I want to redo those in the same style, but with Roa instead of phone on. You're going to make me spend more money on this? <laughs> no, the the crossover <laughs> arc shirts are the sick ones. Those I'm, That's what I'm really stoked for as well. They look super comfy. I, I want. I'm looking forward to oh, that. Oh, yeah. No, the hoodies are actually Pump. super, 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 super comfy. Um, Let me add Ashore one more time. Oh, I was just asking for a keyword. Oh. I'll ping him with it again. Keyword is unfortunate. Yeah. I do not know what that means. That's just what I had left in from the last time I'd made a uni lobby. I think it was a day that my net was still dying because optimum was being optimum. And so <laughs> <laughs> I kept disconnecting, so I just made the keyword unfortunate because that's how uh, everyone who played me must have felt. But uh, this is what? Yeah. Seth Lond, I think we already said. Oh, okay. I guess he's going with the Enkidu here. Ooh, that's interesting. Uh, I know he's been he's been playing a little bit recently. I don't know if he's been playing Enkidu, but uh, maybe. Where's Zappa on the character select screen? Yeah. Y you missed Chaos. Game. So, yeah, what the, what the dog doing? But I uh, will see what our gamers do here. Seeing some Seth versus Enkidu. It's looking pretty normal right now. Just some oh my goodness, trying to smoke. Uh, oh, that that something. Works. Oh, it works this time. He flies into the force function. Unfortunately. Nice. Uh, I like the FFCS. Very safe, meaty. Uh, will be reversals if timed correctly. Oh Ooh. my goodness. That jump button whiff. Or did whiff, that's weird. Okay. Oh, the late JB. Yeah, backdash is the rising JA, but still gets clipped. In the corner, good Ooh. match. Wow. Yeah, Gravy Jones, If you for you guys that don't know, is primarily a Guilty Gear player. You'll see it in their mashing. They they do like the mash. <laughs> oh, <gasps> you that went went the wrong way. way. Yeah. Let's see. Now it's time for Azure to get started. Never mind. I apologize. We're seeing the Guilty Gear gamer. Oh, big drop. Calls out a, a backdash. I think. Okay. To extend pressure. Yeah, Azure says no. Thank you. Gonna hit you the mix-up. Nice block on this. <gasps> no punish. No oh, this stand tech. And bail off. Starters. Yeah, th this is the damage he needs oh, right mix now. Up. Yeah. Good reset. A soul JC. Even though he's in VO, a soul JC scales heavily, so he was not gonna get too too much damage. But this a soul JC will be enough for the round. <laughs> Is there kind of moving a little bit, but Gravy does not care, just runs up. Oh, yeah, we're seeing that FF come into play. Super good option for Anki doing this matchup. Yeah, Azure is just very backdash happy, it seems, and Enkidu has a lot of good buttons, but oh my god, wow. <laughs> Enkidu buttons are a little, uh... The 2A hit the other side, then the 2B the other way, it's crazy. Oh, he was walking this time. Alright, this is a big combo. Not gonna wanna drop this one. 
Well, the, you know, he got CS. Oh, whoa! The parry, it wasn't big enough. Ezra still has a chance. Still 50 seconds on the clock, so still can go both ways here. But Azure's gonna have to pick him up. <laughs> Azure's yeah. just running. Ending early for the knockdown. Interesting situation. Just going for a mix up. We might see a sneaky reset in here from Azure. No resources though, so it's not gonna be too bad of a mix up. But it is Azure, and he yeah, won't mix up. you. Yeah, but he doesn't care. Oh, another assault. Wow. That was a tense situation. <laughs> Azure's mix-ups are terrifying. And you'll kind of notice that once he gets that one hit, he just starts running the train. So, Gravy was able to stay composed, but did lose a lot of his health bar just to get that one hit. Hey, good tech on the throw there. Yeah, just kind of simple pressure from Gravy right now. Oh, Ooh, good call out. Knowing this cycle was coming to the end, knowing he was trying to look for a shield there to get the cycle. Yeah, 180 gets gets sniped, but Azure does get the hit. That orbs that was weird. Oh my gosh, Rising JA is so good. Yeah, I like the idea there from Gravy because I think he knew Azure was gonna oh, Rising JA oh, and he tried oh. to dash under, but Azure is just gaming right now, doing some mix. <laughs> Gravy has had enough. Yeah, that's what I was saying earlier, that once Azure gets started, it's just so scary, but run-up FF has been doing so much work for Gravy. He's gonna have to do up kicks to kill! Yeah, very nice. What's really nice about doing uh, the FF EX dive that Gravy did there is that you can do it even on whiff, so it's fairly safe even on whiff. Ooh, the big 4C counter hit! Yeah, I feel like we haven't seen Gravy use it as much, but 4C is also a really good button. <gasps> Okay. Damage here. All right, Azure, chance to get started. Oh Never my mind. goodness! <laughs> he just blinks in the four C. Yeah, the four C has so much hits done that uh, very bad trade. For oh, what an option! Very smart ex parry on the orb and the dive. Uh, super safe option. So, good stuff to Gravy. Ready for the counterplay. I don't know if the orb was about to go off or what, but I think so. I want to say. I think, and now that I watched that again, I'm not sure if Azure missed their stagger window from 5cc because it is a pretty small window. Oh, but either yeah. way, that was a good challenge by Gravy there. Because Seth 5cc, you kind of have to special cancel. And even then, like after the special cancel, your pressure is kind of over. Mm hmm. Dang. So good stuff to Gravy Jones. We'll be Gravy. moving on. Oh, he's got in Falcon Man in the next Ooh. round. No, oh, no. Top 16 winners. They're going to be playing off stream, though. Mm -hmm. Well, good luck to those two gamers. But we will be seeing Mr. B versus Comedy Man. The return of what? The return of Comedy Man. Tama? It is Tom. Yeah. <laughs> I have no idea who they're going to play. I feel like it's going to be Hyde just because you mentioned that in the beginning. Oh, because I said oh, I didn't want to see any more Hydes after yeah. Saturday. <laughs> Dude, I well, if, he, if he's cosplaying as Comedy Man, then it's probably going to be a Kotsky. It's right? got to be a Kotsky. It has to. Well, the winner of this match will be playing against Omni Deeg, who I guess also had today off of work. So <laughs> uh, I don't know if you guys know, but the Monday off of work is next week, and it's not today. So I'm just making sure you guys knew that. <laughs> hey, Tama going for the Lund, which also like this is a good matchup for Lund. I can't blame him. Like, a lot of the air stuff Ori tries to do gets smoked by 2 and 4B and 2 and 4C. And mm -hmm. Thanatos, you can kind of ignore by wrecking past them. Uh, I say kind of, because you're still going to get smoked occasionally. But... Yeah, I can imagine when they, they do like the FF and the 2 and 4C, like where he falls down really fast, that's a really good option from Ori. Because uh, FF does go really high. So, Rekka's, even Rekka's might not be able to, to stop it, but. Seeing Tama get this first hit. Okay, yeah, recognizing that flower is fake, but just a little too slow on the reaction, and Tama's able to recognize. 
Yeah, Tom with a nice little air hit confirmed, but... Oop, CS is out of pressure. We're back to neutral. Cycle is getting closer. Ama does here to steal it. 6B was not enough to take it, but a lot of damage here. Hey, Mr. B kind of at a loss right now. Tama knows he doesn't really have to commit that much right now. He's, he's having a little fun. He's doing a little free-form pressure. Okay. <laughs> A little, uh, a little troll. We do a little trolling. It's having a little fun. Maybe you can get higher. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Oh, I just noticed the steam. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Okay, that makes a lot more sense. Uh, back in control, that three C. Yeah, that's what I was talking about. That option is so good for Orion. And the Ooh. grid break. It is jailing. I like that. Tama just did a Gappa String into the side swap Rekka just to get out of the corner. I actually really liked it. I didn't realize Long could do that. It's cool. We're seeing a nice little combo from Tama. Super clean route. Ooh, the classic yeah. OS Smoker. Gets a confirm, but this is going to be scaled pretty hard. Yeah, goes for a reset. Oh, but oh. the drop! Full JC adding some preparation maybe makes it a bit harder to pick up there. What a tech on that throw! A scary situation for Mr. B for both players. VO's yeah. also on the table. Oh, oh the no! Is that green shield? Oh my goodness, the green shield pushed him back. So when he whiffed the throw, he was safe. You hate to that see it. You, you can tell Mr. B was getting really antsy because it's been like 15 seconds and Tom is just doing Rekka, Rekka, Rekka. Mm -hmm. And Mr. B is like, surely he's going to throw this time. And he did. But unfortunately, <laughs> unfortunately, Green Shield exists. Yeah, that's another good thing about uh, Lundreki is his jailing options are super strong. He's really good at keeping you in block zone and also ending his pressure in situations that it's just so hard to challenge. What an FF yes. over the wand FF. Oh, you have well, been opened up. Dude, there was a low 4C. somewhere. 4C is such a good uh, button for for Orie right there. Oh my god, whip punishing the B thrust. Oh, big 2 on 4 We saw last tournament, uh, Mr. B loves using these 2 on 4s It's a pretty good move. It's... Minus seven, so you don't want to use it close up, but uh, it's a low actually. So you can catch people walking at a distance. But nice counter hit confirmed from Tama into the freezer outs. Drops the record, but Drop. has the meter to make it safe, although it does the wrong one, but it's okay. Unsold <laughs> JC. Doesn't get the grid break, but still. Plus frames. Ooh. Oh, the hurt box. Oh no. We'll have an awkward to drop there, there, but CS is goes on the other side. Oh my goodness, Mr. B is moving right now. Mr. B is IEDing in a game without air dashes. Or a 2B, but the 5B is too far away to pick up. The whiff punish! Super nice from Tom, but there, yeah, there's no more bounces there. Yeah. Oh my goodness. Oh, what a 3B! Ends up working out. Mr. B has to go for something too. cheeky. The timer. Oh, okay, wait, wait. Oh this could my be it. goodness! You have to kill. No. Oh. Oh no! You can't be He could have. He had to. He had to hold the vo. He had to hold the vo. I don't know if he let go on accident or what happened, but he had to hold down the buttons there. Mr. B. Holy He's coming in a clutch. Dude, that, that 6B CVO, that, I was not ready for that one. <laughs> he, he popped CVO so fast. That was going to be clip of the night immediately. Yeah, that was... He was just said, he just said, nope, you're not blocking. All right, here come these two and fours. Trying to keep Tama out. Nice concentrate. Oh, but that big assault grid swing. Mr. B was looking at the bottom of the screen instead of at his opponent, but that's what you usually do at 11 o'clock on the cycle, and gets hit by the Soul JC. And now is taking a lot of damage. And is in a mix up. Never mind, he mashed. Never mind, he's yes. <laughs> wow, yeah, good shield. Nice shield. 
Yeah, it yeah, goes for the Vio strip. Okay. Okay, Mr. B. I'm just, I'm waiting for. Oh. Okay. <laughs> Yeah, when he's got that meter on deck, he's kind of... It's fairly common that they go for the, the third Rekka there, right? And just uh, reset pressure with an EX option. Mm -hmm. 2 2 six, Ooh, no kick confirm on the... Yeah, maybe expecting uh, that to just work, but... The you know, 6B works, but drops the combo, tries to whiff punish. <laughs> the, uh, Ooh, Backdash actually gets away from the 2 and 4A. Ooh, nice throw. Gonna give him the cycle. What, Tom has got a cycle. Or sorry, Comedy Man has got the cycle. <laughs> Big throw! This is looking good for Comedy Man. Or, yep. I was gonna say, Mr. B's gotta do something. He might VO. Oh, hey, VO's VO. back. Gets the cycle. <gasps> and gets the hit confirmed from the fireball. Oh, the drop. Gets 6B instead of 6-6B. That's unfortunate, because that honestly maybe would have uh, been the end of the match. Okay. Hard to say though. Plus oh, the 6B was a little yeah. too slow. But again, Mr. B was looking at the bottom of the screen instead of at his opponent and got hit by the Assault JC. Honestly, I think one of the biggest things that cost Mr. B the match is they did a lot of kind of, I'm not going to say rago, but a lot of pretty far space charge 236B. And I don't mm -hmm. think that's something you want to do, especially against Lundrakia. Because mm -hmm. we saw him with punish it, we saw him contest it with Rekka. It's usually mm -hmm. a pretty good option for Aurier, because characters can't really respond. But Lond is one of the characters that can. Yeah, it, it's tempting to use it at the uh, like the tip of the range where two three six I see two three six B will hit. But you have to remember that if it's going to hit at the tip range, that they can also just walk back a little bit, and it'll whiff completely. Yeah. So that's something to be wary of. And yeah. it's also her best starter, so it does kind of make you want to mm -hmm. just slam it. Definitely good stuff to Mr. B. You gave us one of the best clips of the night already. You did. We'll see if something <laughs> you did. Pops I, I would have, frame one, I would have stopped doing everything and just immediately put that on uh, on Twitter if you had just murdered him immediately after the 6B. <laughs> Zevo, that was sick. But regardless, that entire ending. Um, also, let me check in on the match, Reno. We are... 99.8%. <laughs> we are 35 cents away Wait, with 35? eight codes left. Yeah, we've got eight codes left, and we're 35 cents away from top four payout. Please use some of those codes. Guys, guys, Track Sweetie dropped $120 into the bracket. The least you can do is click the button. That's all That's true, for. that's true. All you got to do is visit the link. Click claim code. It's that giant blue button on the right hand side, and you can push us over into top four payout. It is. Oh, somebody easy. just claimed it as soon as you. <laughs> Ten more cents. Come on. Ten more cents. One more code. I think you could, that could be you given our fourth, our our top four contender like lunch. That could be you. That's true. That's true. They'll like they'll get their money and they'll be like, man, I love this guy or girl. That gave me that last Matrino code. It could be one of our gamers coming up. We've got uh, Big Black versus the real Tom Clancy. Real Tom Clancy, you don't see him too often in these brackets, but he's here today. And Big That's Black, true. you usually do see in these brackets, but still always an entertainment to watch. That is true. I'm actually really excited for just kind of like looking at the way the bracket's turning out. We're going to have the winner of this is going to face Falcon Man, top eight. And then after this, we're going to watch Deffy versus Mr. Noodles, which I think is going to be a, a high octane set, for lack of a better way of putting it. And <laughs> a real barn burner. <laughs> <laughs> the winner of that is going to face the winner of Omni versus Tama. Oh, boy. Yeah. Gravy's still alive in loser side. He just has to... Uh, He's got to win one more game and he'll be top eight losers. Wait, I think it'll be a high octane set. I agree. I think you versus Deffy is going to be uh, entertaining to watch. Yeah, we've got uh, Twang in the same situation uh, in losers. Did lose to Deffy after beating Koyo, but is uh, 
Has it won depends. their first two matches and losers. Deffy's not going to pick Biak and stare at you. Deffy could very well pick Wald and go for the Wald mirror. Don't underestimate uh, Deffy's desire to... Uh, to meme. <laughs> to mental game you. Yeah, exactly. Mental it game you. There you go. Yeah, don't, let it, don't let it get to you. It, it, it doesn't matter who he picks. Just, just beat him, you know? <laughs> True. We'll, we'll be seeing... Uh, Tom Clancy and Big Back playing. Going to see who beats who. We've seen this matchup quite a bit um, on this stream. Usually it's Big Black playing Byakia, but we've had he's run the hide gauntlet in these in these match fest tournaments. He really has. Yeah, we'll see if Tom stands out enough in the crowd and brings something different. To see if he can get the victory. So far, playing pressure pretty slowly. Kind of trapped in the corner right now. Good oh. challenge on the Rekka. I'm surprised that spacing worked out for Tom. Yeah, Orbiter is such a strong option from Hyde. But throw is also a strong option from Byakuya. So much reward off of, off of one hit with this character. Nice throw from Tom. Gets the cycle and a combo, but does drop it. TGC for a little pressure. Oh. He, he's oh, feeling he's himself. Doing he's doing something right now. He's, he's, he's running some high pressure. Oh, Ooh, my the stare goodness. down. Not going to be able to kill here, though. Could I think if he did a, a bigger combo into CBO, he would have killed there. But he's just playing it safe, making sure he doesn't drop, which I can respect it. Timer's an option. Oh, the TRM on a... On a maybe a one seven one or a stand tag. Big Black doesn't really start off OSing in a set. Like in general, he'll just kind of take the throws the first few like rounds or games, and then he'll start OSing. Mm -hmm. So that was a TRM though. Yeah, so, so that's that's weird to me, <laughs> just because <laughs> I know his well, habits Tom, in general is to not uh, do that. Yeah, I think Tom was taking advantage of that because you know we saw Tom. I want to say throw him like three times. Yeah. So Tom is showing you that, hey, you're going to have to OS against him. Maybe not against some of the other players, but... <gasps> Ooh, jumps into the web, but it's okay. Ooh. Okay. A little weird yeah, situation on the no cancel there, but... Big Black going to be getting the combo. No web set up. <laughs> yeah, Tom mashes out. Doesn't get a full confirm, though. And that hard knockdown is what he needs, especially against a character like Byakuya, who really can just turn the tide with one of their own knockdowns. Round start, Tom. He's, he's playing very safe with these 6-6-Cs. Not really going for any follow-up, any special cancel. Just kind of making sure he has space to play around, but... Unfortunately, Big Black 2C autocorrects misses. Good idea with the assault. Uh, JC doesn't manage the grid break, but still gets the hit. Has 200 meter. We're looking to go in a web set. Okay. Yeah, scary situation. Dash up the throw. Yeah, it goes for the VO strip route. It feels like. Tom is just only going for throws. Okay, Pogo. I'm not sure if that was a 6-6-C, but just Pogo's out again. Yeah. Oh! Okay, it's a little scary situation there. Maybe could have been a command grab. Okay. This isn't death, but again, this is the classic situation where you're in the corner against Byakuya. Tom no longer has CS, goes for a mash. Helping Mash Fest keep its namesake. Tom Tom is indeed a masher. Yeah. Big Black getting the first match of the set, but we are back. Oh big six six C. Oh that orbiter. I like the patience there. Tom is just blocking there because he's got such a big grid advantage that he doesn't need to go for a throw. And he knows Big Black wants to win the cycle. So he chooses to just uh, just chill him and just block for a little bit. Not give Big Black that situation to win the cycle so easily. Notices the drop, goes for a combo. 
Again, the little stare down that Uni's known for. It. Yeah. Oh, Big Black ready this time, though. He said, you stared at me last time? I'm going to run up and throw you. <laughs> Even worse. Yeah, this is a... Uh, JC, I sold JC by itself. Not a great start. But a counter hit or a grid break? Oh, yeah. Big damage. Okay, Tom. Not biting on that TRM. <gasps> oh, wow. Maybe he wasn't sure that Rekka would pick up at that range. I like the Street Fighter confirm. <laughs> Tom really likes this 2A66C, and I guess he's looking for an OS with it. It's not something I see too often, but I, I can see the intention there. Oh my goodness. The deep uh, J16, I think. Okay, he gets confirmed. Interesting, doesn't a reversal? Ooh. Yeah, big black. Kinda chillin', gets hit by 6 B second part. Yeah, sometimes that first hit whiffs and you think you can go in, but the second hit is coming. <gasps> nice okay. tech. Oh no. This <laughs> This is how it starts. Yeah. This is what it all what how it all happens. Tom's gonna have to do something on defense except by something I need to block. You can have to choose correctly though. Big Black is gonna make you guess, but these webs are gone. 20 seconds on the clock. That's gonna be it. The challenge. That's the match. Yeah, that good whiff punish by the bounce, but he did not. Oh, goes for a rego rego. Oh, is he gonna try to chip? Oh, it's no, it's not enough. He was trying to build a meter for like a 236C, but barely doesn't get it. Hmm. Surprised Big Black didn't uh, wreck it on the, the red flash, but maybe he doesn't trust the startup. It is a little bit slow. So it's like, a, I want to say it's like 11 frames or like eight frames or something. It's also, um, yeah, I feel like if he's confident enough to block it out, like why risk the 236 and like potentially, like you were saying, get counter hit and just lose the round. Yeah. But it shouldn't be a risk because there is the red mist. But you know, sometimes but we've all been the there. Red you mist know? Do. We've all been there. Sometimes <laughs> the red mist lies. But what doesn't lie is the Majorino saying that no codes are left. So Yo, let's go. All let's the gamers. Go. Fifty percent I mean, of the way to top six payout too. <laughs> <laughs> we, could, we could be uh, hitting top six payout if someone wants to donate. Uh, you know, a couple hundred dollars. Yeah, but <laughs> wink, wink. Not sure. We have hit top four, so four gamers will be getting some yep. money out of this bracket. So thank you guys. Yeah, no, it it makes a massive, massive difference. Not, not just for this, but for like our general standing with Matcherino in general. So thank you all for using all of the codes. That helps us a lot. Uh, we can work our way up to more codes. And yeah, good stuff. I'll probably still come in and shill for donations periodically, but... You'll hear less about the Matcherino going forward. <laughs> um, also, once we get into top eight, I'm going to run a quick ad so that anyone new hopping in doesn't get one. I like to give people a heads up. But uh, so after this set, I'm going to run a quick ad. But we're going to have Defiant versus Mr. Noogles. I, I don't know if excited is the right word for this match, but I am curious to see what happens. Dude, I got some snacks specifically for this match. <laughs> <laughs> what, what snack is appropriate for this match, Imp? I'm curious here. You know, I have been very fond of peanut M&Ms as, as of late. Yo! So that is, that is my snack of choice. It's respectable. <laughs> I forgot I have some of those. Hey, are you going to join him too? Gonna... Is it spiritual, no, like, peanut M&M &M eating? I had to stay. I had to keep my mouth, you know, ready to commentate. <laughs> that, was a weird way of, that was a weird way of wording. Yeah. But you get what I mean. I do you can't be you eating mean. and commentating at the same time, you know. It's true. It's true. I don't know. Literally, I think the last BFT or Mash Fest, I ate so many coffee like 
chocolate covered coffee beans is not okay. <laughs> I think like literally every other sentence, it was like I was talking or I was just eating. The last tournament I commentated, I was definitely eating dinner during the bracket, but don't worry about it. You're back. Hop on in, Noodle. Is that Deffy in the lobby right now? The one piece is the real? The one piece is real oh, in all caps with three goodness. exclamation marks. Yeah, there's yeah, but I, be anyone else. It could, it could be, it could have been Noodles. <laughs> Can we get much <laughs> higher? So high. <laughs> all right, so this is going to be walled versus random select. I honestly don't know who Deffy's going to play. Probably yeah, not Hank. Maybe I wouldn't be surprised long. if he straight up goes to random. I feel like yeah, that's what he I wouldn't be surprised. Do. I feel like he's gonna pick Wald. I I actually could see him playing the mirror. I'm not even just like I kind of said it half in jest, but I could see him playing the mirror. Mm -hmm. No, the wand. Okay. He sees money in the pot. Yeah, I know what he's saying in VC. He's like, I just got four, bro. I gotta, I gotta, <laughs> I, I gotta think it's usually bro. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> oh shit. <laughs> sorry, sorry, sorry. I hit the wrong button. I meant to mute myself. Jump scare? <laughs> Hyde, is, Hyde is not banned, but... You know, but spiritually, he he's banned. Okay, okay round start. Defi... Yeah, I'm not surprised. Yeah, we have what is essentially a zoner versus a grappler. So, for those of you who play other fighting games, you know how this works. We throw a lot of fireballs, but if Mr. Noodles gets in, then Lon's life is gonna suck. But <laughs> it looks like Noodles is not getting that chance right now, and he's just kind of in Lon jail. Ooh, oh my goodness. Cross up. Wait, he's playing my color, and he made fun of me for picking this color. <laughs> oh, wait, never mind, never mind, never mind. Uh, never mind. My color is a different one. Never mind. Sure, okay, colors are like the most important part of uni. In fact, I think that's why <laughs> Mr. Noodles is losing because this is like weird Mr. Hulk color, like a lion's. Mane. Yeah, this is uh, an interesting world color. Can we bring them back into the corner? Nice combo. Big Vio, you have been overheaded. Deffy is. Deffy spent money on the controller that he purchased and is pressing the buttons on the controller that he purchased. Oh, man, Noodles is spinning the stick on the thing he purchased. Oh my god, that oh. reach is. <laughs> he starts clapping, it's, it's the she hold color. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, that gift is crazy. <laughs> Noodles brings it back. Alright. FF round start? Okay, no, just bad dashes. Well, we saw a stand shield there from uh, from Defi, which is kind of spooky against Walt. So, oh, <gasps> he's a genius! A good option. Oh my god. Yeah, the 623C doesn't actually hit that high up, and if you have ways to stall yourself in the air, you can avoid it. Now, Defi's just. Oh my gosh, the damage. 4.1 meterless? Wow, I did not know that you could combo off of that with uh, on counter hit. What a Yeah, this is scary. Vios, okay. Got the lockdown, but the pedal is shooting the wrong way. Unfortunately, you can't turn it around. Vio back. Striker throw, throw, but text it. Oh. Death, he actually whipped a throw there on accident, and like the clap bar barely didn't hit it. Wow, okay. Maybe Mr. Noodle's color was the right choice. Maybe I was yeah. the one who was uneducated. Maybe the She Hulk clapping is too powerful. <laughs> nice conversion, drops the combo. Oh, oh the no! Overhead. Okay. He thought he shielded early enough on the first hit, but did not. That's unfortunate. And Noodles is capitalizing. Oh, counter hit. 360B. 
Oh, that is not a trade you want to take. Never mind, you are okay. Never mind. You're good. <laughs> Definitely just kind of lost steam. Kind of trying to figure out what to do. Mm -hmm. I think Deffy won the first round, I want to say, but since then, Mr. Noodles, is, Mr. Noodles has just been gone. Yeah, Deffy starting to respect him a little less, trying to do something on desperation. Oh! You hate to see that. Waste the meter and you just see him fail off. He's just a man. Big rock! And he gets the confirm! Ooh, that's a cool round. Oh, oh, that whiffed! Okay, okay, oh okay, 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 okay. Oh! He did it again! Oh, what a belly flop. Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. Nice block. Ooh, it okay. wasn't an overhead. Okay. Deppy's in here. Gets a cycle, too. Lots hey, of resources. Yeah, mix. No. And Noodles has none. <gasps> All's out he the just for seen? He just instantly wow i actually understand that because when walds or when uh what's it called i'm sorry when lundrekias have their opponents in the corner they like to use uh jc and icjc which is really good um so i like mr noodles just going for the the entire immediately mm -hmm. but yeah i guess the one piece was not real <laughs> <laughs> Unless he somehow comes out of losers, which might happen. We've seen him usually go pretty far in these brackets, but he'll have to go up against. Deffy, I have no well, idea. Deffy right now is playing Hadogen Supreme, so he's got another Waldstein. Oh. Yeah, but we've got winners top eight set, as you guys can see right now. We're going to have Big Black versus Falcon Man, which is kind of quickly becoming like a, a mash fest classic we've been seeing them the last few mash fests versus each other which is kind of like a testament to to both gamers wait this but, new graphic is sick and yeah i finally finally in my stream control figured out how to auto pull all the names from the uh from the bracket straight into the the screen oh and like, really yeah yeah and so it'll change Yo. the graphic up top per game too so like it has uni on top right now but yeah Big Black Falcon Man, nice. and then Omni Deeg, Mr. Noodles. Ooh. Also, quick shout out to Tracksuchi. Well, I, I've seen you gift in the subs. You, yeah, you're holding I think that's oh, another, another one gift. to Bryce. I think that's the second gift sub they've, they've yeah. given this, just this tournament. This stream, they, on the live, they went crazy. 23 total gift subs, I think, over the last couple days. Thank you so much. You are carrying the FGC. 100%. Built different. Built different. <laughs> Yeah, I very unexpected, but pawns. very, very, very appreciated. Yeah, also, I did not realize that that anti is a walled 2C. Oh, really? And not 3C, so you can just 2C AD, I guess, which is kind of correct. Hmm. I think walled I solid needs it. He, he definitely has weaknesses, but like, this is uh, overall, this is still a very balanced game, so like, it still works out. I will never play walled because the walk speed just makes me super sad and I don't know the scuttle. Rurik was telling me you can make him like scuttle across the screen, but uh yeah, my you fingers just jump. can't do that. So you jump or you uh you just press the buttons that hit full screen because he has them. Uh his buttons I like are to super air. good. I, I come I come from air dashers and when his walk speed was that <laughs> slow, I was like, can't do it. Just Next. instantly back the character yeah. select. <laughs> but we are seeing Big Black versus Falcon Man. We've seen this uh match a few times. Winner's semi, so first of two here. Uh these sets between these two are usually really great. So I am excited to see this one. We've seen Falcon Man with a very like mix up heavy style play, get him in the corner go for the, the fancy bombo mix up the little puddle and we have big black doing the biakia thing playing clean right now falcon man getting some pressure started trying to cover space for big black wants to be but big black isn't really there mm -hmm. big black tried the dash forward to get that cycle but falcon man gets it and gets a hit but drops and now it's big black's turn to put you in hit stun and in the corner and an oki Yow! Swing, swing, swing. Prepare to die. 
Yeah, I guess caught trying to clear that top web. Gets hit with the low. Hey, 5 dB, my beloved. Just the tip of it. And good confirm from that, too, actually. Yeah, we got the bomb set up. Let's see what Falcon does. Doesn't get to open them up with a mix up, but. Oh, no. A little bit of a weird uh, you know, misinput there or something. Not dashing up quick enough or something. Uh, gets Falcon Man hit. I don't know if Falcon's trying to contest space right now or if he's just kind of pressing buttons. Looking for whiff punishes. Big Black calling out the reversal grab there. And. Oh. It doesn't tech, but Hawkman's still in the corner. There's still a web. <laughs> Falcon keeping his composure gets the reversal. Yeah. We've also seen Falcon at this low health make these comebacks. Oh, it's so scary. What are you going to do? Okay, oh, throw you are not going to tech is what's going to happen. He can never count out Falcon Man. Hey, Put the raw Jason. assault. Yeah. A little 3k combo, almost 3.1. Grid is gonna go to Big Black. Can't do much against the web grid. Fortunate. I don't know if that was a messed up dash block, but just kind of runs into the what? Oh, the stone hat technique. <gasps> the, the, the stone hat technique. He's a genius. Except he went like over. It was like, anyways, he's dead. Maybe. You know, this is dead. This yeah, is like dead. minimum scaling. Yeah, yeah. That was that was not what I expected to see. Yeah, the the new mix OS, walk forward, and then down block. Who knows? It's looking a little crazy right now. <laughs> Okay, round start. Yeah, Falcon's trying to take the offensive. I'm afraid yeah, to Falcon spend man. blood here. Yeah, really good at mixing in these FFs to um, keep up his pressure. So good at just not letting them play. Like, oh, oh my gosh. All this pressure, but Falcon's the one yeah. losing a lot of HP. Ooh, whiffs the 6-6-B. Big Black doesn't get a chance to punish. Yeah, big damage here, but... Again, you look at Falcon, Ma Falcon, Ma Falcon Man's health bar. Has not gotten hit. And has lost a good chunk of health, but Big Black has lost even more. And all we need is one more mix-up. Spends the CS there. Yeah, Maybe, yeah looking for a meter, but still gets clipped. I think he recognized he wasn't going to win the next cycle, so he just took the meter instead. And that was the right option. It does give him 100 meter to play with at the beginning of the round. It does get grid broken, though. And does get hit by Byakia. Cycle 2. I'm smelling a VO, but it's almost a little too obvious. We'll see what Falcon Man does. Oh, oh, no. Tries to keep the plus frames on the third attack, but... Oh, the catches bad catches the two first. No, 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 no. no way. Who okay. tries to catch the confirm, like, but can't. Like, no way. Okay. Using these plus frames. Scary mix-up here. The grid. The grid is coming. Uh-oh. The TRM? Oh, again, not he's not reversing on these red mists. Um, I don't understand. Honestly, just... no. I I was gonna say maybe Carmine would recover in time, but no, he wouldn't. That's the third one we've seen that he hasn't uh, reversed on. Maybe he's been messing up the six the two three sixty input and getting six two three seen. Who knows? But he does take the round, so never mind. I lied. I mean, he still could, but like he didn't in that moment. My <gasps> bay. The counterplay? Yeah, he knows that in those sorts of oh, situations, oh, Big Black oh, likes to go for the B follow-up. Oh, Falcon no. Man unfortunately drops oh, the throw oh, instead. Wow. I thought he was going to try to TRM there, but not a TRM. He he uh, went for the tick throw. Genius. That, that, was, that was really just a player. Like, that was just player knowledge right there. Because I think 
I, 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 so many sets I've seen, Big Black will do that B like follow up web spike to end the round. And then I guess Falcon Man realized that hit five A. That was, that was that was good. You can tell you know like these, both these players know each other. Mm -hmm. Yeah, there's Big Black playing that grid game. Uh, knows what to do. <gasps> oh my god! I cannot believe that People was like. That was crazy. I barely realized that was a TK. Yeah, other people are like, yeah, I do 171. Yeah, I do 3K. And Falcon Man does TK 6B. Okay, the oh. drop is Falcon Needs about to lose CS. I like that option. That is just unfortunate. Yeah, that's unlucky. Still alive, though. Yeah. Oof. Big black on set points, but you know Falcon Man's gonna make him work for it. Already got him in hit stun. What an icy 60 that reached so far. That's a big grid break. Look at Big Black's health bar. Where did it go? Hey, and we're back in here. We have one bomb. Yeah, maybe he messed up the setup there, but. Oh, did not That's mess up the death. fuzzy. Little chain shift here for meter? No, okay, just, just keeping it simple, just uh, confirming the kill, doesn't want to mess it up. Ooh. The stone hat technique? Okay. Alrighty. It's two webs set out. Oh my Ooh. god, clears them all. <gasps> oh, and calls out the 2 and 4C again. Falcon Man has not any luck with that option. This has got to be big damage, right? Yeah. Some pretty good damage. Counter hit Rekka. Guess for game. Oh, wait. Oh, okay. Oh, that was good oh. recognition by Big Black, knowing that the force function would whiff there. Was it able to... Okay. Oh, okay. This, that is such a... Okay, that is such a sick confirm. Holy Dude, the oh FF is so goodness. sick. Like that, realizing it was a low hit and adapting from that, that was really good. Falcon Man gets a little bit more HP to play oh, with. Oh no! But... That backdash gives a big black the grid, but. Boneless Doesn't yes, it's punish. Okay. Mail off. Huge view. You've been mixed. And Carmine's getting more HP. He's getting out. This is what Falcon Man needs. Big black does have Veil off available. But when can you VO oh, is the question. The field just whips entirely. And all of a sudden. This... He's gonna pick a time to mash correctly, but Falcon Man's just not letting him. Oh my goodness! That that felt like a desperation two three sixty. That oh, oh my god! Wow. Holy smokes! He risked that was it like, all. That was like forty seconds of Falcon Man just gaming in the corner. Like just, look at this! Like Big Black is just on the defensive right now. Like he lets that wheel whiff. Like. Or I guess he had CS, but still, that was insane. Yeah, I think he was waiting for Falcon Man to get rid of his chain shift. And also, Big Black did uh, shield into his own reversal, which uh, can help create mm -hmm. bigger gaps to reversal through. So, very uh, well played defense by Big Black there. Damn. That was a set. I was watching that. I, uh, that was yeah. crazy. <laughs> I was like, you know, these sets are usually pretty good. And that was <laughs> that was a banger. That was a banger. Also, thank you, Track Squeegee, for gifting, I think, three more subs. Yeah. Wow. Yeah, we, we, we um, went past 69. <laughs> we just keep on going. <laughs> Actually insane. We got to get to 69, 69, the, the double. That's the only other option. <laughs> no, no, hold up. But uh, I'm actually gonna pull up the bracket again, namely because I like this. So we've got more of uh, top eight <laughs> filled out. Dude, I got it working, and now I'm like so excited. I'm gonna pull it up all the time. It looks sick. It looks sick. Yeah. <laughs> We're gonna have Ajra Undernight versus Deffy, the real Tom Clancy mm. versus the winner of Oh, okay, never mind. Ray K just won. It, knocking out Gravy Jones. So we're gonna have the real Tom Clancy versus uh, Ray K. Um, yeah, it's looking pretty sick. I so this is gonna be Eltnum versus Wald. 
Is this Eltonum favored? It feels Eltonum favored to me. I wait, wait who are we seeing? I'm sorry. We're gonna see Omni versus uh, Noodles. Oh, um, that's a good question. Uh, also, did you want to run an ad before top eight? I ran one. Oh, you did? Okay. Yeah, yeah. Oh, my, you're you're just good. a Chad who subscribes, so you probably. It's seven three walled. <laughs> Damn. Okay. Why did I? Oh, because he can delete projectiles. That's right. That's right. That's right. Okay, it's seven three walled. But what's the matchup? Omni v Noodles. You know. Yeah. And that's what really matters. Ten. Oh. Noodles. Uni is definitely a game where it's like, it really. The important thing is picking a character that you can use their strengths well. Like, that is the mm -hmm. absolute most important thing. Tier list is honestly second in this game because of how strong yeah. the um, system mechanics are. Pick a character you understand and you know how to use their strengths well and you become a terrifying player. Exactly. Like, I watch Omni press 2B and I'm like, oh, the One Piece must be real. God bless. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, Omni's looping plus frames on me in the corner, and I'm like, what? <laughs> it's like, you can shield it, but I'm still, like, plus five. I'm like, oh, okay. <laughs> Omni's doing, like, two and four A. He's just, like, he's just jumping. I'm like, man, this no, is really do be. Two and four. But he should, because that move's also broken. Neldum is broken. Omni just simply has so a broken So high. <laughs> <laughs> is he steaming? That's funny. I don't know. I mean, Mr. Noodles has shown us that the One Piece isn't real. Maybe Omni isn't so high either. We'll, we'll see. Yeah. She-Hulk could be the antagonist of the One Piece. That is such a wild <laughs> scent. <laughs> <laughs> we're seeing that 2C we were talking about earlier. Not going to get a full combo, but does get the chain shift not gonna get a full combo but does get the pressure good shield by omni pretty much securing the cycle but at a pretty huge cost of life he yeah, not gonna get the combo but does get a vo mess up the strip big punish never mind too much recovery i mean too little recovery sorry back to the nooch <laughs> the nooch of oh, omni run nice. up two b nice shield but a bit of a bit of a boneless CS. Maybe tried to CS to catch him to do something and punish with a uh, laser, but did not work out for Just him. Back dash. And we also saw there Wall JC deleting the Elton bullets, which is kind of it's kind of what's going to happen this matchup. It's going to be a little rough. Yeah, all of Wald's claws just uh, delete projectiles, like just while they're moving. So it can be scary. Oh, we've seen this big starter. Never mind, another drop from Mr. Noodles. He's been dropping his routes. I don't know if it's a album thing or what, but um, Mr. Noodles has not been able to finish his combos, and you do not want to let Omni get started with this strike throw. Hey, Omni's is going in. Doesn't have purple bullets, but ooh, oh, hey, I like, oh, I really like the idea. I, I really liked the idea from Omni. It was a good reaction. Holy smokes. And a 623 would have worked, but like in the heat of the moment, I don't think there was a way to tell. Yeah, that was an insane option. Or actually, did Noodles tell from the Super Flash that Omni was doing 421 and then do a reaction J2C? I, I actually he, don't he know. He was already doing it, I think, right? Okay. I don't know. Maybe we could get a replay of that, or is it too late? Oh, oh the six B. Let's see what Omni can cook up right now. He's he's going. He's cooking. He's cooking. You've been meaty. Why are you pressing buttons? The purple bullets. He got the the bombo. The bombo is still going. Oh, yeah. I forgot how Omni's, long this is. Yeah, Omni's gonna make these uh these combos for for sure. Oh, you're in the air. <gasps> yeah, he was scared to four two one C that time because you know what happened last time. Wall did J two C and it whiffed so. Little hesitation there from uh, from Omni. Also had air assault as an option. So, ooh, as one thing Omni will not let you do, and it's it's assault at him when you could also throw him because he will three C A D you. Mr. Noodles will reversal you. Absolutely. And. 
Yeah, Omni getting out of that claw range, going back in. <laughs> Mr. Rule's not biting on the staggers. <laughs> Misses the reload! Oh no. That is very uncharacteristic for our Elden player. Yeah, this does not feel good. You're eating 3.7. Okay, second chance. Hey. Never mind, you dropped. Unlucky. Weird high up hit on the laser. There's another reversal. It has chain shift. That is the double circle. Oh, oh my god. Shit. Yeah, he's just uh, dead. Maybe because of Orbal. That killed, actually. Oh. <gasps> Scary shield. Oh, 6B again. You've been opened up. Okay. Wow, that 2C connected. Vorpal? Yeah, I like the assault. Keep the grid advantage. Gonna have to shield that assault if you want to win that cycle. So. Big starter for Omni. Yeah, 3. Point, almost 3.8 meterless. 5A chain shift. Oof. Cannot VO there. Omni actually baited the VO after the initial bait, so I like that option. Oh, oh he messed up the reversal on the the CS, but you know, go again. You are in the corner against Wald. CS, <gasps> yeah, and just playing safe with the guns right now. Oh, the big crack. That 236 goes so far. Finds the low hit. Got a little meter. This is a little scary. Oh, one C. He believes in it this time. Yeah. Blocking into slamming four two one C. If I was an Elden player, I would be doing that shit all the time. Oh. Taking a breather. Hopefully, surely. Okay, no, he's just he's switching up the skin. Wait, who went? Who went back? I missed it. I didn't see, but I'm I'm assuming it was Mr. Noodles getting the power up go from the Hulk to I don't know what color this is. <laughs> Frogstein. It's I'm gonna frog be honest, I, I see that color, I just think of the of Paz for <laughs> oh. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> Could be a Paz color, yeah I see yeah, it. Okay. But one one for these gamers. Yeah, Mr. Wow, what in the JC? Nice tech. Some Elton pressure. Oh, you've been hit by the Omni Deek. He will do 4 2 1 A and then assault you. And it smokes people. Ooh, Just yeah. like Mr. Noodles getting smoked in this combo. Yeah, Mr. Noodles tried to anti air the assault, but the button was too <laughs> slow, unfortunately. Omni Deek, he's, he's kind of going right now. Hit him with the IC6B2A. Gonna have to we have to swap your block back quickly. <gasps> yeah. So Eldnum has so some characters can do like a a CS safe meaty. <gasps> okay. So like uh, Anki Duke can do like FFCS. Uh, some characters can do ADP CS. Eldnum because she can whiff cancel her A buttons when she's in board board, you can actually just 5A in the chain shift. Uh, uh, that's what Ami did. Okay. Good confirm with meter. I like and the drop like in the change. Yeah. Even that throw tech, uh, it was too slow to get the cycle. But we're seeing the EX confirm from Mr. Noodles looking nice. Drops. Oh, 421C. Yeah, you're not going anywhere there. Already committed oh, to not. Oh, whoa, whoa. oh, the run under. Omni's feeling himself a little too much right now. Omni's pressing buttons. Oh, you cannot. But it's okay. Oh, no, you've been hit. Back to blocking. Grid game here. <gasps> what? No grid game. Oh no, another it must be an Elnum thing, right? It must be. I I I, I guess so. I know Elnum has a weird hitbox for some Linnae combos. So I'm part of Okay. Part of me wants to think that it's also um affecting Wall, but I don't know. Lots of dropped combos for Mr. Noodles, and I think that cost him in the set. Yeah, like, looking at it here, unfortunate. Clap whips there. EX clap plus frames. Yeah, I... Oof. Yeah, regardless, Omni Deeg moving on.
that was a winner's match, so mm -hmm. Mr. Noodles not out of it just yet. Mr. Noodles will be playing the winner of our next match, Raycade versus Palm Clancy. The Hyde Batista matchup. Yep. And I, I don't know how experienced Reike is against Hyde, but I know Tom is pretty experienced against that. He plays Roxy, right? Yeah. He's one of the, the lucky few that can <laughs> wrangle privilege. Roxy. Uh, let me add both of them. All right, getting them in here. Also, I haven't shouted it out in a while because we're out of codes, but if anybody I wants to donate to the match arena, please feel free. We still have more stretch goals. Oh, we're 60% of the way to top six payout. Let's go. Wait, we got a, actually a big donation. Let's go. Oh, four chains. Yeah, you guys. Yo, four chains. Thank you for the 40. Let's go. Four chains and track Sweetie are the... A carrion. <laughs> carrion they, uni right now. Yeah, they've actually uh, donated so much yeah. to these brackets. It's wild. Like overall, yeah. it, it's it's yeah. legitimately crazy. Thank you both no, I don't, so much. I don't think... I don't think they would want to know the total amount of money that they've donated. <laughs> I know I don't want to know the total amount of money I put into like brackets, so I'm assuming they don't either. Mm -hmm. Also, Ray K uh, has tossed a little bit into the pot himself, so confident he's going to make it back, I think. Mm. Well, we will find out right about now with Tom versus Ray K. Yeah, matchup infamous for being not great for Hyde. He kind of gets outzoned, Batista just plays the ranges Hyde wants to be at a little bit better. And no mm -hmm. counter hit kind of messes up a lot, especially with Hyde oh, combos. Like so right here, if Batista yeah. had gone counter hit, that would have been an actual pickup. That mm -hmm. is that is a counter hit pickup. And also, 3C counter hit, Hyde just loses a lot of damage if it doesn't even get a pickup at all. But we're, we're seeing Tom make it work right now. He's going in, yeah. going for... A little setup there. Yeah, counter hit or not, does still get a combo off of throw in the corner, which is really nice for uh, for Hyde. You saw him go into a little safe Oki setup there. Ooh, just a little too slow in the dash throw. Ricky jumping out. Tom playing very patiently right now. I really like it. Nice yeah, I think of pace. there's only 30 seconds left on the clock, and he's in Vorpal and just chipping even more health away. Yeah. Um. Reike had to do something there to win that round. Okay, the, the whiff, air normal to throw. Oh, oh! He gets opened up. Goodness. Out of the corner, unless we can manage another side switch. Oh. Okay, okay, maybe you can't manage another side switch. I mean, he's out of the corner, I guess. But you're down like 6k on your health bar. Your situation, nice block, but the gem keeps up the pressure. Gary Ball, oh, nice concentrate to get that cycle. Uh oh, unfortunate drop there. Wreck a little too far away to pick up. Just Ooh, calls out the oh, oh. Yeah. I thought he was gonna convert that. That would have been sick. Oh, the ADP EX ball has Vorpal, but Ooh, oh, bring nice tail bringer. Oh. Unfortunate, yeah. I think Orbiter, ex uh, Orb Detonate probably. I don't know if that would have fit actually. But yeah, trying to force the plus frames from that slow Orbiter. Now Tom trying to go for Tick Throw. Whip Throw instead just ends up being plus and he gets a small confirm. Quick drop for Cycle. Tom playing this pretty well right now. Yeah, but a knockdown here. Meter spend, nice high damage on the table. He will go with a flash kick. Tom, I think, got hit out of the air there. Maybe trying to go for a bogo or something. Not too sure. But, oh, I don't know if he tried to tell Bringer. Yeah, I that's my guess because he got an orbiter. So he probably would have gotten B orbiter without meter. Okay, but, Ray K. Oh! Okay, the this gem. Is... is that gonna mess up the combo? No, getting the knockdown still, nice. They okay, just content to go back to zoning. Oh my gosh, the lasers. Yeah. Nice Get jump two. over that orbiter. Nice jump over the orbiter again. 
not deep enough on the 3C. Yeah, Reike just spaces a bit too well right outside that 3C range, but all of a sudden Reike's in the corner. Tom has CS, Tom has meter. Oh. Yeah, Reike was doing a great arms. job zoning, but Tom slowly uh, kind of running him to the corner. And you notice Reike was kind of like, oh shit, I'm in the corner. And tried to dash up and pressure, but then uh, Tom had that grid built up and was uh, ready to take the round. Okay, round start. Tom calling out maybe a round start projectile. Reike kind of looking to stop a run up dash block or something. Oh my oh, goodness. He just covered the whole screen in hitboxes. <laughs> I don't know what Tom tried to do there, but he got it. Oh, okay. Wow, Surprising. the up back of Soul. Uh, he's doing some work against the Orbiter. But 236 doing some work against Batista. The 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 the. the the, the delay the bounce match. Okay. Okay, just again going for that ender to build up space. Yeah, build up space and also just uh, give a little bit more time to, for that cycle to end. Nice recognition from Reike. Big hit! Could be the round. But he draw. Oh, but it's okay. Yeah, Tom just chooses a bit too slow of a button. Ray K wins out there. Oh my god, he snipes him out of the air. Okay, yeah, again, just a little bit of zoning. Okay, again, Tom really likes doing that 236B uh, into uh, Ben Sinister Chain Shift. Get some <gasps> distance! The GOAT OS! It was over the DP, and all of a sudden, Tom's taken coast to coast. Unfortunately, drops, but still in pressure. Woo! It's opened up by the overhead. Again. Oh. This is the second time he's gotten hit by, um... Was it Ben Sinister? Yeah, Delay Ben Sinister is really good at catching. It's a, lot, a thing a lot of hides like to do, especially with CS. It's something mm -hmm. you do have to look for, because it leaves him right next to you, easy to continue pressure. Ray K whiffs the overhead, but... Oh, oh, both of them the meeting in the yeah. air. Soul JC just a little bit quicker there. Good tech on the throw, back to some hide pressure. 2-2. Two, two. Ooh, TRM, okay. Don't think... Um, it could have actually gone for a normal throw there. Uh, Tom? Ooh, I like the option. What did he mean by this? I, I don't know if I like that option. That had no invuln. Um, I, I'm i going to assume he wanted 214B and I guess accidentally hit EX. I'm going to assume that's what happened. <laughs> what was he cooking? Yeah, no, Tom, Tom's, Tom's a little spicy right now. Maybe Tom can't get much higher. I don't know what's going on. <laughs> He's definitely taking a lot of damage to hit. With he is feeling Ooh. himself. He feels the veil off. Gets the combo. I don't know. I think he's just gaming. He... I think we're just seeing some Tom Clancy gaming. He just entered EX Tom mode. I, I'm still in disbelief <laughs> about that 2 and 4 C. Sitting there, one hand on the keyboard, typing up a, a fanfic. A Thank you. Hand just... on the stick, smashing buttons. Thinking that maybe he was just ready to... Uh... Had the download, you know. <laughs> Tom's a gamer. We forget because he doesn't join these like that much. Sometimes you can forget, but Tom is a gamer. Mm -hmm. It's true. Yeah, he is infiltrating from uh, the West Coast, but yeah, I mean, uh, he is infiltrating from Utah. It's you got to do it. You got to do it. People don't complain about the connection, so I guess it's it's chilling. <gasps> Utah, but we're gonna see Azure versus Deffy on stream next i'm actually stream excited for this set. this will be another mm -hmm. uh high octane set yeah, absolutely another barn burner for sure <laughs> dude i'm gonna <laughs> steal that that's just gonna become part of my what the do maybe you'll understand this now lid now that you're like you're working you can join the nine to five bracket Every mm -hmm. once in a while, some of the stuff I say on stream like trickles into like Zoom calls and oh. stuff at work, and barn burner is definitely something that's just gonna trickle in. I know it's going to. <laughs>
like yeah this product's gonna take a long time i'll never forget runner. the first time i said we eaten on uh, a zoom call <laughs> and everyone just stopped and was like what <laughs> that's funny my, my, my... My friend had a coworker who, like, they were like, they had just started working and they were going through their trainings. And uh, his coworker goes, "Yo, I'm sh moving through these trainings." And my <laughs> friend's like, "That's that's not what people normally say." He's a gamer. He was a gamer. So I, I would like to say this quickly now that I found out that Tom's two and four C was supposed to be a five C. I, I that was that was living in my head rent free. I need to clarify that. But right now we have Deffy playing the Fox of Color right now, calling out the stand tech, something 214C is great for. Yeah, Deffy is a. We've seen Deffy play a few times this tournament, and he's started out his matches so far pretty violently. And uh, looking like the same thing is happening here. Nice combo, this absurd corner carry that Lawn gets. It doesn't matter where you're getting hit, you're ending up in the corner. But okay. as you're finding a way out of a weird hit, oh, <gasps> that way. was that was clean. Oh my Mix god! Up. Oh, nice block. Oh, oh throwing calls out the force no, function. Going. One more chance. Or uh, Defi. Oh, oh, I thought he was gonna shield that. Oh, oh, no, Unfortunately, no. doesn't get the confirm oh, punish. Oh. Yes. And I think uh, this is where a player like Azure really uh, shines are these scramble situations. Just the ability to make the comeback, just live in the moment, do the mix-up gaming. He goes to the other side of the screen. These Rekkas do finally tag him, though. Yeah, nice walk out of the pressure there, but no full combo on the hit. Okay, shield into reversal. Pretty solid option. Oh, wow, the air ADP actually connects there. But so Ooh, does that hesitation. Yeah. yeah. Hesitation gets him hit. Uh -oh. A little bit of a uh -oh. setup here. Azure's <laughs> <laughs> going somewhere. Nice video out of the pressure. <gasps> oh my oh, god, no. it was over the 2 3 6 C. Yeah, I don't even, yeah, Azure player. was not expecting that either. Yeah, I don't think he was ready for what option that was going to be. Oh, a little unblockable. A little patience there. Ooh, There's the FF he was looking for. Wait, what? Yep. <laughs> when did he put an orb out? Did yeah, I, it was, I yeah, it was off screen. Yeah. I just blinked and I just missed him putting an orb out. <laughs> What? I did not see him put that out. I don't know if I just blinked, like, or what happened, but I was not ready. Wow. Somebody in chat, please go back and try and clip that because I missed it too. <laughs> <laughs> I'm surprised that didn't clear the orb there. Oh, oh my god, my. this. Nice. Azure's been going Burn. for Rising J a lot, and I don't know if it's specifically to beat 2 and 4 C, but it seems to be working out. Like, again, doing a little Seth's movement right now. Mm -hmm. Yeah, 5 BB will punish there. Nice conversion in the corner. Going to see. Some lawn pressure. Oh, Ooh, he's yeah. the green shield. Plus frames. I, <laughs> I'm not sure what he meant by that force function. Okay, remembers the orb off screen. Yeah, nice patience there. Good chain shift timing. Okay, got some recos. Lots of green shields from Azure at the spacing. Let's see if Deffy uh, is able to do anything about it. Unfortunate oh. drop. Some corner carry. Yeah, some damage too. Seth's health bar is also uh, the lowest in the game, so yeah. You may look at the damage numbers and think that it's pretty average, but then you'll look at health, health Seth bar. Nice. Seth's health bar, and I see a lot of his health gone. But we're tied up now. And I can't believe it's already been two matches. I Yeah, that second I, match felt really quick. Oh, the 2-1-4. Yeah, you have to be ready to convert off that 2-1-4-A. 
That Fuse is kind of getting some pressure right now. Yeah, this is where Lon shines. That 2 and 4 that spacing, but Azure was ready with the up forward. Ooh, the drop. Good recognition on the drop. <gasps> Air back dashing away. Yeah, Azure kept himself really safe and was also keeping up the pressure. Super, uh, super good awareness there. Oh, it tried to grab him before the orb, but a little too slow. Defy also would have teched anyways. Defy with a convincing cycle lead. Are we going to see a Veil off? Oh. No, 5A. Oh, air hit. The 5BB does not connect. That's unfortunate. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> what? I, if I was Defy, I'd be a little, I'd be a little, I'd be a little pissed off. Okay, blocks the mix up though. Oh, he tries to wreck and hit his herb before oh. the warp connects, but he can't. I like that EX dive just to get out of there. Works as a well as an escape option. But if he finds the hit 15 seconds on the clock, you're gonna want to kill here if you can. And you can. Yeah, Azure's movement is so clean. <laughs> okay. Ooh. Wake up 5BP. Gonna get hit by the BNB. You dropped it, but you got reset, so now you're taking more damage. I'm gonna hit him with a little out of corner in the corner. Never mind, he dropped it. Ooh. Well, that was like a punish. Throw. Yeah, I don't know if that was landing recovery or what was going on there. Oh, he is JAing. <gasps> I don't blame him. It's a good move. Yeah, making sure Defy, Defy just doesn't wreck at him, but... Yeah, Defy's defense is looking so good right now. Has just not been getting, op not been getting opened up by any of these blinks or dive shenanigans or cross-ups. Okay, does get CS from that. Oh, wow. Okay. <gasps> uh, yeah, Defy will take wow. that interaction, but that... What a dash out into the 5B. That was amazing. Yeah, I, I want to see that. Yeah, force function here. I actually like this decision from Defy to get grid here. Yeah, just using the pedal to cover himself. Yeah, because Asher can't really contest that. And then this. Yeah, uh, that's, that's like just tragic. Yes, yeah, mm -hmm. I think that's tragic. But Defy will be moving on to play against Falcon Man. That should yep. be a pretty good set. But it, before that... We have Noodles uh, versus the real Tom Clancy. Yeah, uh, they are on the other side of losers. And reminder, sitting in winner's finals, you've got Big Black and Omni League. That's true. That winner's finals is going to be uh, fun as well. So, <laughs> for some reason, my, uh, my top eight screen doesn't like putting in the real uh, Tom Clancy as a name. It'll put in all the other names except Tom's. Is it, is it just long? too long? <laughs> no, no, I can manually type it in. It just doesn't pull it through. But uh, <laughs> here's the bracket at the moment. It keeps pulling it back as null. Just Tom's name. It works with everybody else. But yeah. Yep. Noodles winner. versus Tom. Defy Falcon Man. And then we'll head up to winners. Like you were saying, Big Black and Omni. Yeah. In our top six of the tournament... Reminder, thank you to our generous viewers, Track Sweetie, Four Chains, and everyone else who's added to the pot. Uh, we are giving a top four payout for this tournament. Mm -hmm. So be sure to cheer on your fellow gamers. How do you not be a tiny pot? If you mouse over the stream, you'll see two little things pop up. One is like the prime reminder, and then one is the uh, like the avatar stuff, and you can pick which character you want to be. Oh, you can? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Oh, well, I mean, I don't even want to change from Slayer. Like, why would I? But that's cool. <laughs> no, I, I can see why Track Suchi would want to change because they they have absolutely yeah. made well, their mini pot. Huge. Their mini pot, what? yeah. Well, they they want to make the pot huge. Yeah. Yeah. Also, it's nice that that reminder for Twitch Prime is right there. It's so easy to just <laughs> subscribe to a channel for free with Amazon yeah. Prime if your account is linked mm -hmm. um, and you're on a Twitch page uh, that has a subscribe button. Um, I know a few of you guys have went to college, um, or at least started college recently. You know, Amazon Prime student. 
you know, you, mm-hmm. you get a free Twitch sub, you might have forgotten that you can remember about it right now and maybe use it, you know? Yeah. Reminder though, it does only last for a year, I think, because then it started auto-renewing for me and I did not realize. Um, <laughs> so, double check that. <laughs> Okay, All he's right. starting off with the whole color. I don't know what this means. But... Mm. Could be going for a different storyline here. But uh, I don't know if Tom has really fought too many Walds. Um, I mean, you just don't really see them on that play. Yeah, except for in Mr. Noodles, and I don't really know if he's played Mr. Noodles that much. So, um, I think Tom used to play a lot against Bracky back in the day, but I could be wrong. Hey, that's the 6 6 C. Oh, yeah, good reaction. <laughs> they, they are both gaming right now. Yeah, I don't think we've seen a combo, but both of their health bars are halfway gone. <laughs> oh! There's the 5B anti air, but does not work. Nice concentrate. That was really close. Uh, Noodle's barely getting that cycle. Noodle, yeah. Realizes that Tom's on the defensive right now. Kinda a little scared to do anything, so let's go for the command grab. Okay, another trade. <laughs> Oh, Is that comboed? Okay, I wasn't sure if it was a reset or not. There's the DP on Wake Up. Oh, the yeah, crowd's still in. Counter hit 2B. Into oh, a counter hit Rekka. Let's see if we can see a full combination this time. It looks like we're going to. I spoke <laughs> too soon. Again, the okay. grip break. I'm yeah, not I sure what's going on. There. I think 3B is a cool move. I wish more hides used it. Nice low, far, long range. TRM to finish the round. Does kill. Okay. Ooh. Yeah, that does reach. Ooh. Ooh. Goes over. Doesn't get the full confirm, but does keep their turn. Yeah. Ooh. Believed in himself a little too much, that DP kind of eats air, but Mr. Noodles isn't able to get a good punish on it. Puts himself in the corner. Okay, yeah, Mr. Noodles does have the cycle right now. Tom playing it pretty patiently. I like that throw. Especially because Grid is pretty much his, unless Mr. Noodles does that. Yeah, could you see us here for a combo? No, I'm just gonna hold on to it. Try and okay, yeah, saving it for the next mix-up. And it was a good decision by him. And the Hulk beats Morbius in the first round. <laughs> see when Tom can see. Him. It's not my fault. Tom chose the old purple color. Hey, this is like the coolest hide color. What do you mean by this? Dark matter is sick. This is a good color. Oh, and that was a good 5C. No full combo, though. Would like to see Tom um, complete a combo. It's a clean 3C. We do. What attack? Oh, no. Got 3B there. Curious if he missed a 3C or what happened there. Okay, good challenge. I'm gonna get himself the cycle and a knockdown. Get the orbit on screen, a little explosion follow up. Playing some nooch. 3C whiffs, but no punish, actually. It's kind of surprising. Or dash up 3C though. Cycle's coming. Oh, I like the assault trying to get the cycle there, but uh. Oof, unfortunate drop, but like one hit is yeah. all it takes. Oh man. <gasps> the stand shield? Wow. Okay, oh, yeah, Mr. Noodles in 
intent on getting mon the momentum he needs. <laughs> that, that could be the start. <laughs> it's what seems to be working out here. Noodle's gonna get the cycle here too. Keeps it going. Does not care. DP out. Oh no. Wake up, crowd shield. Oh, the meaty fireball into Ben Sinister. Yeah, a little oh. bit of a weird confirm there, but does manage to bring it back in the corner. Yeah. Big 2C matching. Okay, reset? Yeah! Orb did not get hit by the reset. Oh, nice block. <laughs> and text the throw goes for it again, but can't punish. Where's the recovery? Oh! It beat the... He's dead. No, he's not. That didn't kill? Wall health? Okay. Run up 3C. Yeah, that, um... Tried to grid thrust, but the 2TC was uh, still there and did not let him do that. Interesting uh, interaction there. Tom playing, playing a bit more patiently. Oh my goodness gracious. <laughs> oh my goodness. Oh no. Okay, Mr. Noodle is, he's, he just entered gamer mode. Okay, yeah, yeah, Tom, Tom's trying to DP, like, I, at least I'm not going to get perfected. This, I mean, is, this is not your round. Yeah, you did 220 damage, so like, you know. You just washed off, you go next. You, you try to eliminate that from your Ooh. mental, but uh, Mr. Noodles does not care right now. Yeah, 6 two, 3 round star had the meter to confirm too. Oh, weird situation there, but the shield not uh, not high enough. Blocking the orbiter, gonna get the grid there for that cycle. Nice oh, that dash, but... it doesn't grab the shield. Yeah. Oh. Tries the anti-air. Nice EX confirm again to the corner. And he steals the cycle too there. This is... Oh I... no, we I think that Tom's just the coming to all the pressure. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. <gasps> Flies out of the corner and okay. gets another deep P. Uh, Mr. Knowles is not having it. There is no comeback. Yeah, I think Tom did that bell bringer because like the regular DP is roifing. So he wanted the horizontal reversal, but um Noodles was baiting the option. We will see it again right here. Yeah, yeah. Noodles just was just on point that last match. And mm -hmm. I think a big thing that I noticed is that Noodles kind of had grid all the time in that especially in that last match. Because mm -hmm. before Tom, like he was kind of playing around it, he would throw fireballs and he was ready to cancel into like a run up 3C or something. But he just never got that chance in the last round. Yeah. Noodles moving on, losers semis into the money. Although, if you want to get bring Tom into the money, we're uh, what sixty percent of the way? Yeah, sixty point seven percent of the way to top six payout. Almost there. We just got to get to three twenty. If you guys don't want to pay Tom out, you can still donate to like three nineteen. You know, you don't, you don't have <laughs> just to just leave it. Just leave it there, and uh, just leave him hanging right outside the money. Who was it that donated to get us to top four because they knew it meant first place gets a little bit less? <laughs> that, was, that was that was not when definitely That was not, yeah, you're right, you're right. I remember that. That was funny. But uh headed over to the other side of Losers Quarters, Falcon Man Defiant. We rarely actually get to see these two play on stream, I feel like. Yeah, I can see that actually. Because they, they both go up against Big Black a lot, but the, I I don't know. I guess we really don't. Oh, okay. Definitely the last minute change. I guess he saw Hyde play. Wait, Falcon's playing one. What? Yeah, he's been messing with Wald recently, apparently. Um, Noodles was saying earlier he expected Falcon Man to pick Walt. But, uh... Yeah, we'll see how it goes. Okay, can I just mention, why does Wald have all these green colors? Like, this is the third one we've seen that's just green. 
I don't know, he's just feeling the green, I guess. Maybe Noodles has just picked them all out. Or, uh, Falcon Man, I'm sorry. Okay, okay. Got the combo. Feels weird seeing this matchup again. Yeah. <laughs> I guess they got inspired, I, I don't know. He doesn't man. choose to go for a reset. Yeah, I'm showing that he's got the combos though. Wow, what a match. Yeah, challenges, but Falcon does still have the cycle. Ooh. Gets the dash 360, but still unfortunately out of range. Falcon is just trying his best to come <laughs> there, but unfortunately he's just uh, a bit too stubby. I told you, man, unless you know the scuttle, wall movement the scuttle. is rough. That's what Rurik told me. He said, you scuttle, and he just he runs across the screen. Definitely maybe trying to bait a command grab there, but Falcon not biting. Oh, no conversion on the combo. Two eight, two eight, two eight. Oh, six two three. CS. Yes, interesting option. Get some nice little three K though. Okay. Then he gets the grid break. That was right on the CS. Was probably supposed to actually be a chain shift, but uh, did not work out for him. Six P does though, and definitely finds a way out of the corner. Gonna get himself the grid cycle too. Over orb jerks. Oh. Okay. Damage, damage, but he still damage. needs one more hit. Yeah. I think throw. Yeah, throw here will kill too. Oh. Get it. Okay. Oh, oh, I think he went for the throw. Yeah, but Falcon Man calls it out. Oh wow. Okay. Falcon Man going yeah. for the big read there, but does not work out. I don't know how fast 3C is. Let's see real quick. 10 frames. Okay, yeah. Pretty fast anti air, but uh, not gonna cover the ground at all. Okay, yeah. Uh, Falcon, yeah, starting to remember he can cancel all those orbiters. He doesn't have to respect it too, too much. Ooh! <laughs> Maybe a 360B just kind of turned to a TK. Oh, unfortunate. Steffi's still ready though. Those long range grabs are not gonna get him. Okay. Oh, nice mash, but. Main shift keeps Steffi's pressure up. Yeah, Orbiter. How can, uh. Walt Scene's claws may delete projectiles, but you cannot delete Orbiter once it starts exploding, so. Gonna have to deal with that option the old fashioned way. See how Deffy deals with this pressure? Gets thrown. And grab one more chance. Doesn't tech it this time, gets the change. Oh, it doesn't matter. Okay, round start. Deffy just wants his turn. Pulls out the shield. Oh, throws him out of the corner, but it doesn't matter. 6 6 season back in. Oh, the third. He says third when he does it. Put him back in the corner. Oh, yeah, oh he's going through! <gasps> oh, but a weird interact uh, situation there. His inputs did not come out correctly. This is the punish. Oh, and I that like is that. Definitely death. That was the cheeky, like, Enkidu mix up. He did partial FF into 2 2 to so hit him with low. Nice little mix up there. Okay, Falcon not really getting the space he needs. Can't really get any of his mix ups going. Oh. And the grid break. You, you do not like to see it. Oh. And again? Yeah, I'm not gonna die because, you know, throw scaling, but. You are eating 
You are eating a lot of damage. Yeah, 3.4 for getting thrown, by the way. You're dead. And, and yeah. For those who don't know, Deffy is also a very strong hide player. I feel like he's played a lot more Lawn recently in Mash Fest, but he definitely still does have a hide. Hyde is, at this point, it's probably his most played character. Yeah, I believe that. I think he's past his Anki Do, his Anki Do time. Um, I'm going to run one more ad for everybody in chat, just so that for finals, one doesn't pop up for anybody that jumps in. And I got to change room settings and everything while I do it. So while we yeah. got some downtime, I'm just going to run it. Because we are in first to three. Territory. And if you use your Twitch Prime, you don't have to get ads. You will don't. You don't. You can just. That's true. I should get them. the Giuna Cry command. He yeah, has whenever he runs ads. He's like, <laughs> like, just makes fun of people crying about ads, and he's like, Twitch Primes are free. But uh, free money. It's true. It's true. It's true. But Big Black Omni League. I don't know if we've ever seen this, to be honest. Um, yeah, I definitely seen them play, but. Yeah, but I, I, I don't think we've seen them, yeah, like, in, in uh, Bracket. Yeah, not in Bracket, I don't yeah, think. I'm maybe, you, think. maybe once. But, um... Actually, if it was in our Brackets, I can just check the the uni keep on rocking real quick. It's true. Yes, we document all the matches. They have played... How they long played, ago was it, though? They played 14 months ago. Damn, okay. That is... Oof. They played June 1st of 2021 was when this uh, VOD was uploaded. Damn. Let's see, let's see if anything shifted. Oh, this is the bracket where Paz reset the bracket against uh, Big Black. Oh, I remember. Wait, no, never off, mind. Right? He didn't reset the bracket, but he wasn't grand finals. Anyways. Here we go. It punishes the L2, eh? Okay. Big Black just doing a little simple pressure right now. Run some strike throw. Nothing too crazy. Just trying to figure out Omni's shielding habits right now. Yeah, Omni is... Uh, I think plays fairly similarly to Big Black where... Um, really buckles down on the strike throw game and grid game and will just play the game mechanics. Um, and does it hit this shield? Big Black a little too slow on the sand shield there, but... Yeah, Omnidig is playing it a little safe. Expecting Big Black to mash. There it is. We saw this few times where Omni just backed off and waited for Big Black to do something. He just kept not biting. He wasn't biting. But uh, now he bites and catches Omni Deke finally. Timer. Omni is forced to make a decision here. Doesn't have CS. Yeah, those last few moves give him that option though. What a throw tick. That was so late. That was so late in a throw tech window. I think Big Black was just blocking there because he was just letting Omni run down the timer. And he could have challenged, but just decided not to because he did not mind getting thrown. Uh, but then did challenge and then used the timer against Omni D, playing the game on a macro level rather than the individual interactions. Oh, what a stagger. Yeah, but still in the corner still has that web manages to clear it finally. Ooh, oh, okay. okay. You know, if we take the Street Fighter cover, yeah. Yeah. Not as much damage as he could have gotten, but still on get, still getting some damage. And the big thing here, too, is the purple bullets. Lots of purple bullets. <gasps> but the green shield pushes him too far away. And that is going to hurt. We might see a VO strip. Yo. Okay. Hey, Omni. Cycle. Uh, oh, right. 
Not sure what happened there, but uh, interesting. So he he could have CVO'd and killed, right? Um, I think so. He got with five A five times into six B, so I don't know. Something's happening. Yeah, went back to room. I don't know if is Omni having controller issues or something. I don't know. Not. I don't see sure anything in Discord. Not. Maybe it was just replugging real quick. I'm not too sure. Maybe he just needed a moment. You know, that was definitely a, a little frustrating, right? Yeah. Yeah. Okay, he's playing a little bit neutral right now. It's that first hit though, it's not what you want Biaki uh, to do. Oh, that actually works on delay tech? That's I messed up. Not looking too great for Omni here. Big Black hitting you with a 4k combo in the corner and CS. Mm -hmm. One more whack ass mix up will take this round. Yeah. Nice little weight there. Helps confirm the combo and gets meter, 200 meter into the next round. Yeah. Okay, just kind of contesting space a little bit. Oh, that, yeah. Gonna get that shield there to get that cycle. Oh my goodness, okay. Mashed okay. correctly, but... Oh, I see JC catching. That button is really big, but... Isn't able to confirm off of it. Nice bait on that green shield. Omni gonna get the cycle here. Some momentum, we'll see what he does with it. Oh! I think Big Black would attack that throw actually with that uh, 1 AD there. But the counter hit to B! It's time for some damage. I was gonna say, Omni's pressure feels very reserved. Very short strings. Purple bullets again. Ooh, nice throw. I guess it works out. Yeah, Omni's definitely playing things safe, trying to really feel out uh, Big Black's defense. Catches him with the running 2B. Great button with Elton. Takes him all the way to the corner, but Big Black does have change shift. You're gonna wake up, but Omni doing a good job to bait it. There's the dash of 2B again. Such a strong option. Gonna get some nice knockdown here. 3.7. Depending on what hits. This could be last hit. Omni gets a nice counter hit. Could end the round right here. But Big Black does get Vorpal. 40 seconds though. Big Black, yeah, Big Black still has to do something. Appearing relaxed gets... Don't confirm. Ooh! But Omni 3C! That's the classic Omni dig. He will 3C AD. His 3C his, his 3C AD success success. Oh my gosh, dude. His 3C AD success is so high. The Omni 3C, it just it has more range. Yeah, it has more range. Uh if he does it while he's getting thrown, the tech window like becomes bigger for some reason. Um no, he's just super good at, at 3C AD. He's got really great defense, but he was looking at the cycle, and that's when Big Black assaulted. Happens. I've seen that happen a few times today. Okay. It's the tag at the end of the cycle, taken back to the corner. Dagger pressure from Big Black, trying to just lock down Omni. Not really afraid of this chain shift, which 
um, was kind of surprising because chain shift into two and four C is a great option from Eltnum, but 30 seconds on the clock, Big Black is not going to press a button for the rest of this entire match. Um, never mind, I lied, he took the throw. I'd use the plus frames if I were you too. And yeah, this is just looking kind of yeah. hopeless for Omni, yeah, yeah. Not much you can do. Very unwinnable at that point. I really like the space Big Black's playing at because it's a space where Omni kind of has to commit to run up 2B or gunshot. And mm -hmm. Big Black looks very comfortable playing around those options. Yeah. And even now, just his defense is looking immaculate, pokes out with the 5A. Yeah, big 5A, big reward off of those hits. Gets a drop though in the corner. Both are sitting on a full meter. There's the 214. Huge snipe from Omni. Gonna net him, not a ton of damage, but gets him into the corner against Big Black, which is right where he wants to be. Ooh, yes, yes, is on the plus frames. Doesn't get. Yeah, you cannot oh, reversal there because yeah, Elvin's on the whiff cancel. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You can whiff cancel and 2 and 4 C there, or 4 2 1 C. Um, so good, good on Big Black for not falling to that knowledge check. Nice tech on the throw. 6B is blocked. Purple bullets. Nice hey, damage here. Oh, Yo okay, strip to... Yeah, win the cycle, but the <laughs> grid no is control. pretty even. I see 6B. Timer is oh. a factor. Big Black has to make something happen. Oh. No shot. He still needs a reset here, I believe, to get the life lead. Oh. Wait, he's... That is... That's actually enough. Yeah. Oh my goodness. I was I was expecting the throw. He I I I lost. I cannot believe that that was enough. He, he dropped the combo. He just stared at Omni for a little bit and it's like you're not you're not you're not dealing with this. Yeah, that 63 C did more damage than I thought it would. More back. Uh Big Black is on set point. 2 1 in the set. Omni D finds the first hit though. Nice full combo here. Misses the bullets. That's huge. Omni has no bullets. This is really bad. He's not going to get a chance to reload. He's going to have to maybe 2 3 6 C or something. I don't know. It's very scary. Oh, whiff throw is plus. Omni's in a bad spot right here. Yeah, going to, to web set. Yeah, gonna have to like spend meter or something here to uh, get bullets back, but Big Black is just not gonna let him get the chance. Okay. Gets to 100 meter. Oh, messed up the. Up there or something? Okay, text a throw. Omni's turn. Oh, is he gonna go the for a reload here? Oh no, he's just gonna take the combo. Oh, he can kill. Mid reload out. Genius. No! He dropped. Oh, but Big Black. <gasps> okay, the back dash. Omni. Okay, this is for both players. Nice. Oh, he didn't get caught by that two and four. That's crazy. Yeah. Wow. Oh, Jeez. my goodness. If he had a little bit more time, I think he could have made that comeback. But mm -hmm. no, Big Black played too well, made sure that it couldn't happen. Yeah, I thought Omni was going to open them up, but Big Black's defense too strong. Okay, yeah, and looking at grid check, he passed. He was not looking at the grid. Nice confirm. Yep, sitting good on grid. Yeah, Big Black's not gonna take a risk there. I'm trying to win the cycle. There's just uh, no point when the grid deficit is that big. But has a lot of grid for next cycle. Oh, he's gonna have to do some throwing. Oh, whoa, 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 that is... Not that is unfortunate. Ideal. Yeah, Big Black pulling out the stone head technique to get out of the corner there. You can see what Big Black can do. Omni does have the life lead, and there's only 30 seconds left. But this is Byakia, and this is Big Black. Omni Deke doing a good job so far, though. Timer, you got 20 seconds, Omni. Uh oh, what the throw into the web? The Byakia combo is going for kind of long, Omni. Oh, it does have Vorpal, though. 
Now the question is, will he VO strip? No. He's he just wasting this. more time. I don't know if I agree. Yeah, and then he, he goes, uh, yeah. Oh, and then the web. Yeah, okay, yeah. That works. Yeah. You're right. The Biakia combo was long enough for Biakia to, uh, for Ruby Black to take the set. Two timeouts. That set. Or the that third game, that fourth game. Holy smokes, I can't talk. I don't know what happened after that first match, but it kind of seems like whatever happened, they went back to the lobby screen. Like Omni kind of lost momentum there. I, I don't know. Yeah, Omni lost the first match, right? I think so. Yeah, Omni lost the first match, won the second, and then uh, okay. we saw lots of timeouts. But, I mean, Big Black is a player. We've seen him do it a bunch, like... He's very much somebody where after a game or two, like he picks up on your tendencies, your habits and everything and just like it's yeah. you can kind of just like take control of a set. Yeah. Also quick shout out to Track Sweetie for gifting another sub. Wait, another to, one? Uh, I missed it. To yeah, yeah, to Deffy. Damn, thank you so much. You're going to start looking kind of weird if you don't got a sub badge next to your name in this chat. That's all I'm going to say. <laughs> <laughs> Or a VIP badge, you know. That's true. That's true. Cause I don't have because I don't have a sub badge, but I have a VIP badge. Oh yeah. But that does cement actually. Uh, we have our top four. It was actually cemented earlier. I lied, mm -hmm. but uh, don't worry about it. We have so Big Black sitting in Grand Finals, Omni Deeg, um, sitting in Losers Finals, and we've got Noodles and Deffy in. Losers semifinals. All four of these gamers will be getting some money. Shoutouts to the community for gifting all the money so we could pay out top four instead of the normal top three. Mm -hmm. um, and yeah, we'll be seeing Noodles versus Deffy next. Yeah. Deffy kind of going through a, a walled gauntlet. Starting with Falcon Man. <laughs> now he's going into uh, Noodles. Yeah. Well, we'll is this see a run back? This is a run back. Is it? It is. If I remember correctly. Yeah, Noodles sent Deffy to Losers 2-0. So, uh, we'll see how it goes. Also, I haven't shouted them out since earlier. Well, Lid actually shouted it out. But, if we have any oh. stand techers in chat. Oh, we've seen a few. Exclamation point drip. We got stand tech gang, hoodies, and long sleeves. They're mad comfortable. They're, uh, probably the highest quality thing that I've put together. Out of all the stuff we've done, I'm really happy with them. They are on pre-order until the 31st. Um, on the 1st, I'm going to send the order to the printers, and that'll be it. They won't be available. So uh, if you want a Stan Tech Gang hoodie or, or long shirts. sleeve, yeah, yeah, yeah. Make sure to, uh, to nab one while you can. Do not miss it. Yeah, it, the design looks sick. It looks comfy. Like, uh, that's all you can ask for in clothing. Like, come on. Okay. Deffy choosing to go hide potentially instead of lawn. Let's see if that makes the difference. Let's see what color noodles goes to. Hopefully not green. Give him the gold steam. Do it. Where are you going? No! <laughs> I mean, he's Frogstein. It makes sense that he's green. Okay, Tracky Suchi, can you take away his gift sub for picking the green skin again? <laughs> Imagine Frog if you could put contingencies on gift subs. <laughs> <laughs> if you get into winner's finals, you'll get this gift sub. Otherwise... Oh my god, barely Orbiter Explosion hits there. Okay. Seeing the pressure. Noodles is blocking out, Kate keeping the grid. Tries to leverage the chain shift there, but uh, Duffy does not care because there is no meter. Ooh. Okay, good with punish. The noodles calls it out. Now Noodles turn. And are we gonna see the command grab? Yep, plus frame. Deffy does still manage to win the cycle, though. Good CSDP. OK, 
Okay, Noodles is not having any of that. You are not jumping up there. You're not doing anything. Good quick EX option though from uh, Deffy. Takes a round, round start. Uh, Noodles goes in. Yeah, oh, some shields trying to shield those uh, air options, but... Oh, there's the detonate. Yeah. Really good option uh, from Hyde. Ooh. The wall pressure. Oh, okay. Recognizing that Def, he's being a little bit more chill on defense and just going for a concentrate. Ooh, the 6P. Ooh, and he goes for the BO strip. I like it. Second ref Reco whips actually. Noodles doesn't recognize it, so Deffy does keep his turn. Again, 6B. You cannot be eating only 6Bs. I know you have walled health, but it is a lot of damage. Yeah. 2A starter. Okay, just 2A tick throw. Gets the job done. We are back down to first to two. Oh, just a reminder because we're on yeah. loser semis. Did we change the room settings? We did. Okay. So these gamers also know. They should. They've both been here before. Yeah, well, the game will kick them out anyways, so. Okay. Yeah, Duffy just trying to call out a throw or a command grab, but Noodle's being pretty patient right now. Oh, chooses the mash out at the right time. Has that chain shift, but yeah, no reversal to back it up. Ooh, but can do that option. Interesting. <laughs> Can't let the laser, because laser yeah. is a good move. Walled claws are OP. Oh, nice dash up Rekka. Let me get definitely a full combo here that he drops. Pressing 5B. Noodles just pressed shield four times. Oh my god. God. And uh, don't worry, guys. Hyde is back to being the best character again. <laughs> oh, that move trades. Hyde's broken. Okay. Oh. The stand tech. Not even a uh, command grab. <gasps> what? The record to try to challenge, but I can't believe that one. <laughs> okay. Command grab. Noodles is activated. Oh, Ooh, never mind. Deppy is activated too. Okay, bro, never what, mind. What are these hitboxes? They're on like the tenth layer of Yomi. I don't know what's going Ooh. on right now. Opening, but does uh, give Noodle CS? Yeah, that, mm, yeah. I don't know about that. Uh, that opening, not gonna kill though. Last hit uh, for both players. Oh, laser works out, but doesn't get the confirm. I think he missed the six six C there. Ooh. Ooh. I like the idea, he just didn't have enough HP wow. for the trade to work out. Yeah. It's unfortunate. Oh, <laughs> round start 360B whiffs. <laughs> Red break J2C. This should be damage if Deffy doesn't drop this. Mm. Unfortunately, he does, but. Okay. Hey, Deffy playing kind of safe on offense right now, waiting for Noodles to kind of do something. <laughs> Never mind, Deffy. Is that uh. enough? Okay, he just finds a chance though. Oh, Dash the run off Rekka. This is the combo again. Okay, comboing off Rekka there is hard. I, I can't blame him for that one. But. <laughs> Two, three, six, C. Using the five, A, A, A pressure. Oh, we're gonna hit out of the rock startup, but. Another command grab. Noodles still has a chance here. Not too, too much time on the clock, though. So gonna have to do something. Definitely still possible, though. Ooh, well, good run up 3C. Deffy 2-0. Oh. Yeah, Deffy just playing a lot cleaner, I think, than when he played his launch versus uh, the Wald. Mm-hmm. Also, I think high 3 c helped a lot more here. <laughs> yeah, it's a bit of a button for sure. 
Steffi will be moving on to play against Omni Deeg in mm -hmm. our losers finals. Who the winner will be playing against Big Black in grand finals. Bam. I'm trying to think of the last time I've seen these two play. I've seen them play probably offline more recently than online, to be honest. Uh, yeah, I wouldn't be surprised. Yeah, I don't know if they really play in bracket. I don't know if they have okay, online. They have played in bracket in Mash Fest 6. 6, damn. Okay. Oh. October 22nd, 2020. That's almost 2 years ago. Damn. Can you believe they we've been running played. Mash Fest for like 2 years? For 2 years. <laughs> That's crazy. <laughs> That's so wild. Mash Fest 6. These gamers have been here since the beginning. Literally, like, pretty much the beginning of uni. Well, was uni, at least. Mm hmm All right. First to three. Room settings changed. No more Matcherino codes, but pot available for donations. Let's get into it. Okay, yeah. Hi, Dalton. Yeah. Wouldn't, uh, would be surprised if they picked anyone else, to be honest. I think they played offline. They did an offline first to five at a CEO, but I do not remember how that went. I think they forgot to record it. I don't remember if they uploaded it. But, uh, we're here now for a first of three. We're doing a little bit of smoothing. Debbie finds the first hit. Does not confirm though. Yeah, it doesn't believe in his mash. They are playing on layer 12 right now. <laughs> Omni's like running up and then doing like a Street Fighter shimmy. But Defi finds the hit again. Let's hopefully see a full combo here. Never mind, goes for a little uh, heck there. Finds another hit. And goes Ooh. For yeah, that's pretty good. One more hit. This blocking though, then they, you know, uh, Deffy was in. Mm, blocks Opal. the little tricky. Five A. Yeah, five A. Great option at that range. Uh, seven frame option. Do I, huh? <laughs> I guess he just went over the bullet. I I almost didn't even see that. Yeah, most characters, if you up forward at round start versus Elmum, you will go over uh, two three six A. Although I don't believe it works for every character. Okay, Omni has Cycle now. We'll see if he can do anything with it. Right now, Deffy is looking pretty dominant. Oh, well, get to 6B on accident. Probably wanted 2v6B. Deffy's just mashing after the 2-2A. Two -two Not seeing a chain shift. Ooh, yeah. Accidentally messes up that confirm oh. there, but it doesn't matter. I'm surprised that he went for DP there, but Deffy was ready for it. Yeah, Deffy just. I don't think he kind of. It just looked like he knew Omni D. He knew when to mash there. Mm -hmm. Omni knew when to mash on the 660. No cancel. Gonna get him in the corner. Got some nice purple bullets. Deffy was ready to take a throw. Omni was not. Nice little damage here. And cycle. Def Deffy strike throw. We know okay. Omni's other thing is really good, but Deffy offense just so strong. Yeah, if these slight delays on the throws must be getting yeah. Omni off guard or something. Omni's hesitating to OS, I think. Oh, such a low EX pogo. Nice shield on the 2-2B, but doesn't give Omni a chance. Ooh, There's okay. Omni's chance. Finally gets out, and you get hit. But Deffy messed up the confirm. But Omni missed up the confirm. <laughs> yeah, Deffy's been doing a lot of throw. I, yeah, mm -hmm. Omni just scared OS, I guess. Yeah. Hesitating will get you killed, but patience is so strong that. Lots of green missed. shields from Omni too. Mm -hmm. Deffy got the cycle, no meter to back it up though. Two two. <gasps> So yeah, I cannot confirm, but... Omni's going up there, oh my god. 
Yeah, going for the side swap. 2 and 4 C Ender. 6B, not gonna work on Deffy. EX Orbiter. Skip the nuke, start the pressure, but. Deffy okay. tried to play patient, and Omni seems to be adapting. <gasps> yeah, calls it out. You're not getting the cycle there. Oh, you've been meatied, but the drop! I don't know, Life Lead is still looking pretty good in timer. I, I don't see how Deffy. Oh. Yeah. Told Jay. Okay, ooh. Again, good block in the overhead. Catches the back dash there, but can't really get a confirm off that. Ooh, Polish movement. Nice 2A. Oh, oh whip throw, yeah. throw into plus frames. The three C doesn't really work out, but still in the corner here. Defi does have meter and CS to play around with. Okay. okay. No yep, reset. Not the under. Advan Ooh. Oh no, that's a big I... drop. Okay. I don't even think. Uh, yeah, Omni. <laughs> Yeah, I don't I'm, think he was expecting Laser to be cancelled out by that. Yeah, I was surprised that the bullets didn't, like, uh, the Laser didn't delete the bullet. Um, interesting interaction. 2, 4, 2, 1, B. Does have Bridget Allen bone, so I see the idea there. Nice delay FF frame trap. Oh, okay. That's right. No, just going mid screen. Yeah, good confirm. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> oh man. Yeah, I think Deffy's doing a really good job playing at this at tip high five A range where Eltonum really has to take a risk with two B there. Ooh, gets a little throw combo there. Yeah, hide 5A is definitely a pretty nice 7 frame option that is, can be hard for a decent amount of characters to contest. Okay. Definitely felt that DP, but Omni. Omni's just ready to punish there. Yeah. Okay, we're just blocking, we're just chilling. Getting some grid. Getting some cubes. Doesn't get the confirm there, but still maintains pressure because of CX. Soul JC in the throw. Gunshot CS is going to get on the started here, but a little low on bullets. Nice. Gonna be able to reload all of his bullets and drop the combo. Ooh, the TRM. And I get TRM. I feel like Omni just always has cycle now. Yeah. Omni very good at playing the grid uni game. Nice OS on the throw. Not ready for that one. What a fast dash up. Two bullets left. Yeah, gonna just do 2 3 60 to get some bullets back. But now those minus frames are gonna give Deffy a chance to get started. Which he needs to make something happen. 17 seconds on the clock right now. Yeah, Deffy was not even wanting to take a risk to win that cycle there, but I think if he wanted to win this round, he had to. Good stuff from Omni. Two of them are definite Discord call. I could check, actually. <laughs> oh, Deffy. I don't know if this is the play. Oh, they're deafened. They're deafened. Okay. But yeah, Deffy um, is using to go for Enki. I don't know. I don't think it's... No, I think it's fine. I think... 
Deffy really likes going Enkidu in some some matchups. Sometimes he's just like, man, I wish I had parry. <laughs> and then and then he picks Enkidu, and then you know it's worked. It's worked. His Enkidu is definitely like super real. This color looks so sick on Enkidu, by the way. It's true. Shout out to the lost colors. Okay, 2C. Six six B, nice. Tries to go for the partial charge mix up, but I'm um, not biting. Cliff throw is plus. Yep, scary situation to mash there because thank you, you can always just do four C, but we will be seeing the third stage of the wreck connect. Big damage. Here is where Enkidu shines. Enkidu's pressure is so strong, but a super good jump. I think he just, I think he air drifted. I could be wrong. I know, I think so too. Backdash is from his daggers, but still gets caught. Ooh, nice throw. Run the 2A. Yep. And calls out the shield. It's not death, but Ooh, pokes out actually. Yeah, gonna get a nice side swap here, or just goes for the VO strip, that's even better. I don't remember if you can VO I remember if you can side swap and VO strip on double 2A starter. I don't think you can. Oh, the 2A. I mean, okay. That's enough! He meated? Wow. Oh, the delay. 5B trying to blow up a 3 cad. On the defense, too solid right now. There's another 5A no cancel. There's the DP. It does manage to get in the cycle too, but. And throws him back in the corner. Block on the IC 6B. Nice throw tech. Really making Omni. Uh, oh my what a 6 6 Oh my. He's nice in combo. there. Big corner carry too. I like the FFCS trying to call out something. It's caught up with the overhead. Not gonna build enough grid. Could have done actually a 2CCC ender there and uh, won the cycle, but did not work out. And now Omni is comboing Deffy. Tides have turned. Patience, but calls out the 2 way mash. One more hit. There's the throw. Omni on match point. Ooh. Oh, so much recovery. Yeah. The slightly missed faces and Omni's able to take advantage of it. Oh. I'm surprised uh, he's going for these uh, 1ADs when Enkidu has uh, FFOS. Maybe just not feeling the input right now. Messing up FFOS doesn't feel too great because then you get VO and you definitely don't want VO all the time. The late icy JC, it hits so low to the ground. And that oh, is tricky. Death? No. No. Needs just one more little opening. Oh, okay. Deffy. Yeah, Deffy. Just, oh, and simple but perfect too. I didn't even realize. But yeah, I just kind of feel like Omni got the download at the end. Mm hmm. Like, just really good cycling of options. I buy both players, too, to be honest. But, like, the cycling of options in general is just really good from Omni. Yeah. Like, especially in that last round, we just see him, like, every single option. Yeah, yeah good stuff. Definitely. Damn, Omni's moving. Yeah, Omni. Big Black sent Omni to losers, but uh, Omni's back. He said, no, no, no. I need another. I want some of the money. He wants the run back. He wants the big. He wants the lion share of the pot. But uh, but good stuff to Deffy. You know, still getting third place. Deffy, wait. Deffy lost to Noodles. Yeah, round three was in losers round three, and mm -hmm. won four sets in a row to get to losers finals. So. Yeah, Deffy was gaming. He mm -hmm. uh, he played a lot. Tabbed out. That's why. Dude, I will never forgive Kimone for changing the default uh, Q 
keyboard commands from uni to type Lumina. I can navigate a uni <laughs> lobby with my eyes closed on my keyboard. I try and do that in Lumina and I'm just like, I don't know, it feels like I have two left feet for hands. <laughs> Okay, we'll, we'll see what Omni does differently here compared to when they fought before. <laughs> I, I guess play very patiently is what they'll do. Again, just like before, Omni's gonna look for his opening. Until then, he's just gonna chill a little bit, do some short block strings, but Big Black does challenge there. Okay. He's the green oh. shield, kind of approaches, but doesn't really do much. Yeah, Omni showing the three cat, not getting a combo, but oh, the shield into the challenge. Yeah, that is still plus one, I think, on shield. But uh, Biaki at five A is just the dominating option in that situation. Ooh, catches with the low two C. Will be the round if he recognizes the bounces. Uh oh. Okay. Oh, that is unfortunate. I think, I think he was just trying to mash DP, but didn't get his buttons right or something. I don't know. Oh, the 2 1 4 catching the walk. Yakuya players love walking around on screen, so. Hold them 2 1 4, kind of nice for that. <laughs> Big Black Hi, oh, Bay. It's also kind of nice for that. Kind of nice for any situation at all times at any point. Okay. Yeah, Omni not getting the chance to stand up, tries to dash block out, but still gets it. To be, to be, to be. Oh yeah, calls out the two B. Omni's had enough. Yeah, it's a nice little side switch too. Doesn't have to change the routing. Works out for him. Got the cycle. Calls out. Oh um, Omni loves to do that cheeky 6 B into 2 and 4 B or J2 and 4 B, but yeah, it gets called out. Good. Big Black is ready. Ends up killing him for that. That was so nice. That was clean. Was ready for the option. Again, I think that's just like a, a player knowledge sort of thing. Because I, I don't really see other Elms do that. I guess I don't really yeah. see other Elms, period. But. I think Big Black was just ready and, you know, you can jump and react there, but I guess 5A is just also an option. Probably like, I don't know, 40 frames of starter or something. Nice defense from Big Black. Gonna get the side goal. See what he does with it. Oh, gets a counter hit on the async. Okay. Yeah, just kind of pushing him out, creating a little bit of space. Ooh, three speed Uh oh. Cycle goes to Omni again. Not even spending it. Just kept it that whole time. Using async again and pressure to reset. You might see Big Black try and uh, do something about that async, but maybe getting a little mentally overloaded, not ready for the 6B. Barely not doesn't kill, kill but. Oh, throw. Yeah, yeah, Omni. Wait, trying to look for a straight gunshot there, doesn't connect. Ooh, no wait into the 2A. Okay, good run up throw. <laughs> Omni just goes for it again, misses the purple bullets. I, I like Omni going for gapless pressure there, making sure there's no option of any sort of reversal because it's just going to hurt that much more in VO. Again, Omni keeping pressure pretty gapless. 
Mm -hmm. Ooh! Yeah, that hits that time. Yeah. Nice concentrates. 5cc plus frames. Kind of, a, kind of a boneless CS. Didn't really get too much off it, but... Let's see if Big Black can do the mix-ups he needs. Are we going to see 6-2-3-C? Oh, Omni is ready! Ooh, but Big Black is oh, even more oh, oh, yeah. yeah, technique! Oh my gosh. There's no way. I can't believe he stole that right at the end with the time. That, that feels bad. Those health bars were so close. Dude, the run under 3C was as such good recognition as, that Ami dropped the combo there. Yeah, actually so good. Ami getting his turn though. Gonna see the knockdown. Tons of purple bullets. Maybe you'll see if we goes for those. I yeah, there's the IC. Can't reversal there because Elmum's got meter. Oh, I can't believe that beat the laser. That's pretty tragic. Yeah, the 60C was just already out before the super flash. Let's see what Elmum can do here. Uh oh. Okay. See what Elmum can do here. Omni unfortunately gets clipped by the web. Yeah, that's it. Yeah, He's not okay. dropping that. Big Black tournament point. Yeah, Omni has one more game to adjust, but based on what we've seen, he does have the potential to do it. Okay, yeah, just trying to stuff out all Omni's approaches right now, make sure he can't assault or dash block in. Trying to force Omni to use Gunshot or 2B or something. Oh, oh no. What a big drop. That's so unfortunate. So much pain for dropping there. Oh my gosh, the meter build. What a 5A challenge. I actually didn't know that was a punish. Yeah, 214A is minus 8. So, at that range, not something you want to be using as Elmo. <gasps> and the grid break. Yeah. Uh oh. He could have had like 2,000 more health and he would have died too. Big black. Could be the hit that leads him to tournament victory. Yeah, he has cycle, he has meter. Okay, DP. This is what Omni needs. Throw back into the corner, that's good. Omni getting some momentum going. Going for IC 6P again. Interesting that he's been doing a lot more of uh, IC 6Ps than uh, just regular 6P. Maybe trying to catch a delay uh, 180 or something, but catches the 180 there. No challenge from Big Black this time, but Omni's running the strike throw. The 5A into 2A cancel rebeat was kind of nice. Omni's showing he's not out just yet. Yeah. He actually used the 5A to like move him forward into the 2B. Like the whiff cancel 2B. That was actually sick. Okay, web setup and yeah, big black grid. Ooh, barely not catching the shield. Omni playing it safe on the CS has a ton of grid to work with. Oh, not this time. Six and C does not work out. Omni be looking to take his first game of the set. There's the uncharged XP. I was wondering where it was. 
Is it enough though? We've got a lot of scaling here, yeah. Oh, we got the plus frames on the icy bullets though, yeah. Nice offense from Omni gets in the first game. Omni is like, I'm just, I'm constantly impressed by Omni's strike throw. Mm -hmm. Like, Big Black's defense is strong, and then Omni is just doing such a good job of stagger, stagger throw, immediate throw, like, slightly delayed throw. Mm -hmm. Definitely, uh, when I, like what I was talking about earlier, using your character's uh, advantages, right? Mm -hmm. Omni's definitely super good at doing that with them, and especially with their close range pressure. Yeah, none of that Byakia teleport. I got a DP. I'm not holding that. Okay, yeah, that does put Omni back in the corner. Ooh, scary green shield. Woo, trying to be a DP. Ooh, with a double fight. overhead, man. What a delay, Rekka on the IC 3C. Okay, Big Black is back again at match point. Barely outranges the 5 but it doesn't matter because he calls out the Assault JC. Yeah, big read on that uh, Assault JC, gonna give a nice counter head 3C combo. Yeah, 3.7 all the way to routing. Line. Yeah. Scary situation for Omni. Big Black just locking down, not really advancing too much. Yeah. Getting, waiting for Omni to uh, slip oh. up a little bit. Oh! oh. oh. Was not a drop, actually. Was not a drop. Gonna hit him with yeah. the Iwex. Making right. sure he doesn't drop it at the end. Yeah. That was... Uh, that, that end, that was a cheapy, bro. Mm-hmm. <laughs> already yeah. start on the replay, yeah. I... So he did Rekka. Yeah. Yeah, it just dropped out of the regular ender, but like... Wait, so it did uh, Omni tech forward there, and is that why you got hit? Or I don't or know. Can we go back across again? <laughs> yeah, I'll let it. I'll let it loop around again. I I don't. I'm not sure. I think uh, maybe he just neutral teched, and Biaki was behind him. There's no way that is so BGs if that's actually what happened. We will find out. I think it was a yeah. It was a forward tech. It was a forward tech. Yeah. He was getting body blocked for most of it, which is why he didn't go. He said he forward teched in yeah. chat. Yeah. Okay. That was hype on me. That was a fun set. GG's. These gamers, top four will Boom. be being paid out. Yep. One more thank look at the match, Reno. Oh, yeah, thank you, everybody who donated. Tracksuchi, 4Change, Ray K. I know you're not, your name's not up there, but I did see your donation. Uh, and all the the gamers that use the codes, thank you so much. Um, yeah, that was wild. I did not expect <laughs> all the donations and all the gift subs. Thank thank you everybody. But um, for those of you who don't know already, these are every two weeks. Uh, Mash Fest itself is weekly, but Uni is every other week. We alternate with Type Lumina. So next Monday will be Lumina, and then the one after that will be Uni. Um, if you feel like joining, hop in the Discord. Um, give yourself the Uniclear roll, and you'll get pinged for all of our Uni brackets. Um, what else are we running? On Wednesday this week, we have... I think it's Plus R. And then on Thursday, we have BBCF. Um... Sunday, I'm going to try and find somebody to fill in. I'm going to be working East Coast Throwdown, so I will not be able to host on Sunday, but I will see if somebody is around to host our beginner brackets. I think this week is Grand Blue, but I just want to make sure we don't overlap with anybody because I know the beginner brackets, especially weekends can be tough. So it'll be either Uni or Grand Blue because we had to ax uh, yesterday's Uni because my net died. Um. Yeah. Yeah, what else? Buy a hoodie. True. Buy a hoodie. Uh, oh, god damn it. <laughs> I oh, forgot no. there's multiple. I forgot that the avatar thing uh, <laughs> took over shop from Moobot. 
uh, hoodies on sale until the 31st. They look sick. Um, I'm going to send the order to the printer on September 1st and get them printed pretty much immediately afterwards. And uh, I think that's pretty much it. And the next live is going to be on the 17th of this coming month. The last one was awesome. If you have a second, definitely uh, check out the YouTube and go and watch the sets. The uni bracket was a lot of fun. But uh, next one will be on 17th. We're going to run the same five games. I'll have signups open probably tomorrow. Um, I'm going to finagle the timing a little bit just to, uh, to make sure everything runs smoothly. And yeah, that is pretty much it for me. Lid and Werb, what do you guys have to shout out? Uh, I just want to shout out WASD for being such a sick community. Uh, great place to hang out and talk to gamers and play games. If you watched this tournament and you were like, damn, that was epic, and you want to play, then you can join the brackets. If you thought, damn, that was epic, but I suck, it's okay because there's a beginner tournament. So don't be afraid to join the brackets. Uh, great place to hang out. Also, once again, shout out to Track Suchi and Four Chains. And anyone else who added to the pot, very generous. Thank you. Uh, yeah, I don't really got much more to add on, but especially thank you to everybody that contributed to the pot. Like it, it means a lot. Also, if you guys are not following uh, Lid and Werb on Twitter, you're missing out. Lid, a uh, budding content creator for Uni on YouTube. I know it's been a minute since his video, his last video, yeah. but in general, his content has been uh, top notch. So I would definitely track down uh, its Omega Lid. Yeah, on I actually just hit 100 subs today, so I can change my YouTube URL to like something that's not a bunch of random characters. So uh, I will do that soon. You need the first to 10 run back on Omni. You want to do it at uh, at Taku? I'm building a really mini actual stream PC. That's not just that laptop, because that laptop's actually kind of a pain. So uh, I'm kind of down to drag it some places and do that. I won't do like a whole crew battle because wrangling 20 people, I've come to realize is impossible when so many people just like make top eight of other games. But uh, <laughs> I'm down to do like first to tens between people and stuff. This is for salt, let's do it. I'm all about that. We gotta do the in-person run back. I'll bring I'll bring a whole setup and everything. Uh, hit me up in Twitter or Discord. Um, honestly, Twitter. I'm really slow on Discord. <laughs> I'm really really slow. I get so many pings in Discord that I'm slow. So if you want to hit me up about something, hit me up on Twitter. Um, I think I'm following you, so you should be able to DM me. But on that note, let me see who is streaming. And I'm going to send you all on your way. Goodbye, gamers. Good. Yeah, have a good night, everybody. Yeah, good night. I'll miss you guys. <laughs> for, all you, for all you nine to fivers, good luck at work tomorrow. Oh, yeah. And if you uh, if you got top four, please, please, please remember to join the match arena so I can pay you guys out ASAP. But, um, yeah, I'm going to send everyone to Tasty Steve. He's uh he's doing some tech and gaming, which I love to watch. And uh yeah, I will catch you all later. See ya. Bye bye. Good night.